It's okay. Like it's dumb that people even use that. Yeah. It's really stupid. Such a risk. I'm glad you guys are smart to this stuff. Lots of people are not. They they don't care or they don't care. And that's what a lot of people say is they they don't want to take TikTok off because yeah. the United States government yeah, is watching them too. Right now. Can you hear? You can hear the thing. Okay, so. Hello. Hello. It's all me? Yeah, so you can hear us clearly, but you can hear the fan in the back. It's echoing off your phone to that, too. Yeah, sorry. It's echoing. Yeah. But I was saying that for the, the new season of Jesus of Kaisen had such a quality upgrade. No, yeah, it did. Did you see when he was holding the pen and moving it? It looks fucking amazing. Do you feel the fan still? It's better. It sounds like it's it's better. Like a, oh, that might be well, that's the, the phone hitting that, hitting the phone. Yeah, hitting the that. phone and it's hitting that. Mm. So it's echoing. Do you think what we have is acceptable? I think so. I can turn the fa I can try turning the fan up a little. I know it's fine. Check. It's actually pretty cool in here. Okay. Are you okay, Mike? I know you and my, me are the hot. I'll drink this when I'm uh, doing. I know Rufio's not happy. That's why he's oh, down oh. here. He wants hmm. to be in the the tile. The air. The tile. <laughs> yeah. Okay, little guy. Okay, I think we're ready. Is everybody excited? It's been four long weeks. August 31st. Yeah, I'm excited. You guys look excited. Oh, yeah. Look like you can hardly handle it. You look like you can't stand it. Yeah, no, the enthusiasm is over. It's overflowing. It's bubbling over. Go ahead. Kick us off. Yes, we're ready. I'm not programmed to go past 100%, so I'm back down to like. Oh, I see. You don't want to go to 11. Yeah, yeah. You know no, what that no, is? no, no. It's like a bug where is? if you go to eleven, it goes back down to one. Well, actually, yeah. <laughs> it yeah. flips all the way around. Yep. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's what it does in numbers too. Yeah. You guys know what eleven is? Where it comes from? Spinal Tap no. movie. No. That's the guys talking about their amps, and everybody else has an amp that goes from one to ten. Mm -hmm. But he shows them. He says ours goes to eleven, and the guy says, "Is that because you want to be louder? Or is it because you?" Uh, you want to be the, the loudest band and everything's much better and la 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 and the guy looks at him he's looking at him he goes this one goes to 11 they're real stupid yeah. <laughs> that's the joke okay Rob Reiner I did my whole uh, spinal tap okay we're anyway ready. this one goes to 11 yes we're yeah we're ready. ready are you ready we're kids ready. we've been ready we are sure. We're positive. We're oh, more than a hundred percent positive. We've, we're, we're, the, the dial is swim, swimming all the way back to zero. You know what? I agree. All we need is one. We need Mike to raise their hand. Such a teacher's pad. Are trying to ask questions? <laughs> she was the victim. Next time somebody else has to, <laughs> has to raise it. Now, one. Th everybody's very happy to be here. We haven't been together for four weeks. Yeah, right? it's been well, quite some time. Everybody's happy. Yeah. Mike, let's hear it. Mike is very excited. Mike is playing with the dog. Okay. One thing that's going to bother me the whole time, so we have to fix it, is this. The red tablecloth is, is much shorter on this side, Michael. So you need to pull it on your left-hand side. I don't a even need Further it. down. Take it away. Further down. Thank it. you. Why don't it's you show me. the experiment, you Michael, where you tug it off the table? People, you don't want people to see my thighs? Yeah. It just Thick uh, thighs saves lives. <laughs> Otherwise, people will creep. You're Henry Cavill no, thighs. <laughs> oh, did you, you got to have something of Henry Cavill's thighs is just as good as any milk. Okay. So it's been four weeks since we've been together, and we are the League of Roses. We're here for some super happy fun times, right? Woo! We're here to kill things, right? Yeah. And we're here to figure everything out, right? Maybe. I don't think we will. Wait, what? I don't think we will. Figure everything out? Yeah, I don't know if we even remember. Well, I know exactly what happened. I don't really remember at all. Some victim gets to be the recap. But before we do that, as we always do, we're going to say and welcome our uh, team here. Our team is the White Rose. They're one of the uh, ten groups of roses that are in the League of Roses. That's why we're called the League of Roses. Mm -hmm. And these, uh, each of these roses uh, are monster hunters. This White Rose is in Barovia right now, and so they're going after a big bad guy named... Strahd. Oh, I'm, I'm so, I thought you were going to yeah. say Strudel. I was going to do Strudel, Strudel. Well, when I answer Strudel. That's answered how much we Strahd. forgot. It's, it's a lot of forgetting, yeah. Forgetting Everybody's that. forgotten everything. I don't even know what character I play. 
Well, you're gonna find <laughs> out. We're gonna find out because yeah. we're gonna go gosh, introduce. Gosh, that's a great gosh. way to introduce what we're going yeah, to do gosh, next, gosh, which gosh, is everybody's gosh. gonna introduce themselves. They introduce their. Character, Don't forget, count them on count. Give a little description about them, and then we have a question that we ask everybody to gain insight and understanding of their character. Uh, so we'll go with that, and we always start on the very right hand side with the first victim, who yeah. is uh, Michael. Hi. Uh, Speak loud. What are you chewing on? Hi, my name is Michael. I, I play the character of Lazarus. Yeah. Lazarus is a warlock. To be more okay? specifically, he is a Dao uh, Dzin warlock. Well, so he, his Take patron is a uh, Chini. And more specifically, Rufio. he follows the Dao Chini of the Chini of the Earth. And oh, this grabs him some way, special abilities no related to Earth, Paper like towel. summoning spikes mm -hmm. or. Uh, mm -hmm. Like melding with stone and stuff like that that her unlocked later on in the adventure. Well, Maple, you see and that a lot. In terms of how the character looks, he has white oh, hair. Uh, he I'm has a scar there. running down his sure. uh, chest. Yeah. He with his left you arm bandaged. You're hey. being very bad. Now he's yeah, Michael is being very persistent. He's, he's doing being the best he can. I just let him eat whatever he wants to eat because that way him. he'll learn. You know, and then either he'll it's either stop or not. I can't put my hands in his mouth. Because mm -hmm. he scars me up. He bites so, me. He bites me. Yeah. So, thank you, Sarah. You're welcome. Okay, sorry yeah. about that, Mike. Goodbye, right. and That won't be the first time the... we'll be stopping for him, the little turd. Yeah, and then for the <laughs> I'm character thinking there's going to be a number two. For the day. <laughs> oh, there's a number Oh, the question for <laughs> the day is, is your PC is in a bu is from a bunch of people in the middle in a great hall, and he's stripped naked. What are they most embarrassed about? I mean, is he the only one naked? Yeah, he's the only one naked. Okay, I guess he's uh, he's embarrassed he's because he's the only one showing himself off. Boo. So he's that happy with himself that he's only embarrassed. Very clever. Yeah. I, knew, uh, I knew this would be uh, different. Yeah. Boo. Well, if okay. it was... So he's previous, embarrassed that nobody else is showing if himself If it was off. my other character, he That's wouldn't good. give a crap. Because my, yeah. my previous character was a nudist. I know, but yeah. still, you, you, we're all embarrassed about something. Yeah. So you wouldn't be embarrassed about the big red. No, we won't go into that. Okay, next up we have... My name is Richard, and I play the character Grutz. Grutz is a 6 foot 10, 290 pound half-orc bar wizard. Who is not a bartender or anything, but a half-barbarian bar wizard. Yeah. Oh, I guess it could be a bard, too. Yeah, they yeah. are, yeah. Or bored. Yeah, maybe he got. Maybe he's a lawyer and he got his bar. And he passed the bar. You never know. He's, he's been barred bear. from it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I can use many magical oh, powers awesome. called Shatter, Smash, and stuff. And you know, there's even a uh, anime where there's a guy who also has muscle magic, mm -hmm. just like Garage. It's muscle magic. I like yeah. that. Yeah. Magic of your Very muscles. Good. Yeah. Yeah. You could do pound, collapse, destroy, and break. <laughs> Bicep crunch. Yeah. Bicep crunch. Yeah. You know. Uh, Any other description? Uh, he's his okay. long, flowing, beautiful hair. Okay. A beard that can act on its own. Yes. That's uh, sentient. That can frozen, move and has 20 strength. And while you can hear us, you can't see us. Where the hell did Here. you get that? See, rubber is going to just come out. I'm the taking stuff out of dog's mouth. You just shove your whole hand in his mouth. You just shove your oh, whole man. hand in there. You gotta be Where better. did he get that? you got to be a better little guy. Go in and see oh, your grandma. Oh my god, I thought I kicked him in the face for a second you there. probably did. I kicked the you chair. I honestly, oh I saw him, I was like, oh shit, I kicked him on accident. No. Oh god. He's, he's under everybody's feet, so. I so, right, is he okay? Gr All right. Grutz is, the show on the road. Grutz's still. body <laughs> is a temple. And so if he's naked in front of people, usually he's prideful. But that's the front of Grutz. Because Grutz, sadly, doesn't have an ass. Oh, he has a zero ass. Yeah, oh, okay. his ass is as flat as it can be. Oh, okay. He's very ashamed of his ass. Oh, that's yeah. nice. That's good. It's a that's flat good. ass. So it's a, it, at least he doesn't have to look at it. Yeah. He doesn't have to see it. That's why you see his front never his back. That's why he doesn't retreat. So who told him he had a bad ass? His, his mates. Ah, oh, okay. His friends. Yeah, yeah of yeah. course. He's so well, He's there to tell you something yeah. bad. His wife said, gosh, you're great from the front, but boy, there's nothing in the back I can grab. There ain't no fucking trunk in the back, I can tell you that. There is no jump gray, in this trunk. Uh, a flat gray ass. A flat gray ass, yes. Uh, that's, that surprises me. You would think he would have a big ass. Yeah, table. because of his girth and his size. Yeah, you know, sometimes when you get too muscular, it affects different parts of the body. It doesn't eat enough to, to affect the, the cakiness. It's not a is cake. Is it because he doesn't sit enough? No, it's, he doesn't eat enough fatty foods. He doesn't have a cake. He doesn't do squats. Uh, it's it's tough. It's hard. It's like iron. squats, yeah. You should get a BBL done. That's true. What's that? Brazilian butt lift. 
He needs to do them BBL exercises. He needs to start squatting and that's probably too much. <laughs> packing his his yeah. ass cheeks like that. So is any what is he sensitive to people patting his butt? No. No. Okay. No. That's good. No. That's good. It's hard though. It's not soft. Oh, it's hard. It's yeah. just a hard flat ass. Yeah, you got a hard ass from working out. Does he, he have problems sitting for a long no, time? No, it's fine. You can't sit through Titanic or anything, right? It's too long. <laughs> <laughs> the last <laughs> Avatar. Oh, my ass. Oh, when does this Avatar get... The, it's not the last Avatar, was it? It's Avatar. The, just Avatar. Is it Avatar? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm thinking I'm confusing it with people. the Airbender. Sorry. Okay. Just, All just, right, enough on Gratz and his yeah. ass. Okay, sorry. Hi, I'm Sarah. Uh, I play two characters. The first one I'm going to introduce is W. He is a 27-year-old human witch who hey, kind of deals hey, with the spirits. Hey. He imbues his weapons in the spirits. He has a Henry Cavill chin. He has brown hair, blue eyes. Yeah. So he's not ugly. No. Um, he's he is clammy. Yeah, I was just going to say. And he eats he's, bugs. He's, he's, he's got a curse. Mm -hmm. Okay. That could be detrimental to some women. Okay, so, he, you know, here we go with another guy with an attitude. So he's stripped down in front of a whole mm -hmm. bunch of people. He's the only naked person. Mm -hmm. So what is he most embarrassed about? His calves. His calves. Nobody's worried about their schlong. They aren't, they aren't toned enough to where he wants them to be. Well, you know, you're doing a lot of walking, so maybe that's going to help, huh? Yeah. He's he not the most uh, dexterous type of guy, so his calves it's aren't all as good as yeah. like, a uh, road. Just ask yeah, Jimmy. It's all in his calves. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So he is definitely insecure about his calves. Again, they're in, he's not something you can necessarily see, so that's, yeah. that's a good thing. Now, we all probably know what's going to come with N, but still. Um, my second character is N. He is W's older brother. He's 87 years old. He's a human, and he's a paladin for his goddess Ezra. He recently swore his oath of vengeance for her. So to ho in hopes to become an avenging angel. Now, he is a tank, and he, we, have, we probably always should mention that he was artificially... Or through yes, magic. Yes, he was magically aged. Aged 60 years. Right? He was only two years older than W, but now he's uh, much older. 62 to be precise. And he laughs at W's calves. Mm -hmm. Okay, so N is has been, yeah, it's all his life. Hey, look at your calves. So, okay, uh, uh, he's Just stripped imagine down. His calf 62 I can't imagine years later. ever being stripped down in front of people, but <laughs> stripped down in front, in front of a whole. No chastity belt. Oh, my God. Well, we'll see. No, yeah, that could be, you know. So what's he most embarrassed about? His nipples. Ah, okay. One of his nipples oh, is, is, is a little bit pinker and a little bit bigger than the other nipple. Oh, holy shit. So he's a little insecure about it. One of them like also, <laughs> Yeah, one of them also grows hair a little bit more than the other. So oh, it's almost oh, even. He has oh, to trim it. Oh, <laughs> that means wow. one of his balls is lower than the other. <laughs> so I thought, like a lot lower though. I thought for sure it was going to be the chastity nope. belt. But he's not. not embarrassed about that. That's He's proud Actually, of that. Yeah, he's very proud of that. It's the nipples. Wow. Wow. His nipples. He needs little wow. sensor bars over his nips. That's why he's always wearing armor. Mm -hmm. So he's to hide those things. See? <laughs> you thought you were perfect. Next to these guys, you don't have anything to worry about, right? Yeah. Exactly. Your nipples are okay, right? Yeah. You got two, or do you have three? <laughs> okay, let's move along. <laughs> you know Anne Boleyn had three nipples. Did you know that? No. Yeah. Yeah. I know some people Sit. like grew up with like. Sit. I don't know no. anybody, but I heard it is. Supposedly like, people can have. Three it's pretty nipples. common. I think Mark Wahlberg has no. three nipples. No. Is that right? No. I'm not sure. I care about him, but it, Anne Boleyn, it could have been Tom Cruise. Yeah. Really? It's one of them. That's Man, that would be damn interesting if yeah. you had three nipples. That's Mission Impossible, huh? Well, that's this is Scientology. Nipple you know? Impossible. That's how he explains it, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Because the great beam in the sky gave it to me. It's a it's a positive. It's just spent on how you look at it. Right? Imagine if it was on the belly button. <laughs> oh god, that's gross. An idiot and an Audi. Okay. Ew. <laughs> right next to each Ew. other. Ew. All right, and finally we have. Quit doing that, long guy. Uh, uh, hi, I'm Mike. I play Yimmy Kaya. He is a two foot. Four. Four. <laughs> two foot four inch. Two foot pound. four. Two hundred pound halfling, uh, professional hunter with high grade calves. Yeah. He he could bounce with the best of them, you know. He can do a flip. And that he can do. He can bounce. He can do at least three front flips within one mm. flip. We've definitely got a disparity in our image of what he looks like. Exactly. I think he. I think and he'd be embarrassed that anyone would see him naked. 
Well, you would think, but we're going to probably find no, out. No, the narcissist. Yeah. The narcissist. Yeah. So he has a uh, peacock leg. Yeah, the everlasting peacock leg. The everlasting peacock Oh, my peacock God, this is the leg. first time you got the bird right. I don't. I know. That's I know, true. I know. No, 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 no chewing on wires. No chewing on wires. No chewing on wires. No, no, no. That's not for you, little guy. Dog. He's, been, he's just trying to get attention. Stop trying to chew wires. Hey, stop it! I took my shoes off. Good job, little guy. Come here, little man. He's just bored. Okay, but you're speaking, so you can't entertain dog and chew at the same time. I can. I can double task or whatever. Okay, we'll see. Okay, what's the question? What are we talking about? All right, so you strip Jim you know, and what, What's he embarrassed about? So yeah. Jimmy Crittier Carlos is, is a, a whole did you try to say crowd right of people. Jimmy, what? A whole crowd of people. Yeah. And he's stripped down naked. In, in you know, I mean, he's all two hundred pounds, glory. two foot four of him, sweaty, pubic with his sweaty body. pubic hair, hair, and his. Sunglasses. Even his sunglasses are off. Okay, that was that like was Roy the, that was the uh, that was what I was waiting for. If the if the sunglasses are off, gone. Everything's gone. Okay, that, that well, if the sunglasses are on, he's not afraid of anything. You know, he doesn't give a shit. He'll he'll waggle it all around. You know, he'll he'll flop, he'll flop left he's, and right at the same time. He has to be time. embarrassed about something. But if you take those sunglasses off, Jimmy Carlisle's got beady little eyes. I knew you were gonna say he's eyes. Got little fucking eyes. You know, yeah. they're a little too yeah. they're. That, not just a little too far apart. They're like right fucking here, you know. Oh dear God! On his little potato he's like a deer. Head. He's like a deer. On his he little is. potato head. You don't have the real real center. You can't. Is, is, is you know. That means he can't see center. Yeah. He can't see in front well, of that's him. That's true. No wonder you miss it when you're firing your arrows. Yeah, he's, you he's, can't he's see in front of him. The world's worth. Uh, uh, you have a huge blind spot right in front of you. But his eyes are a little cross-eyed. Like one, he's got a little Google. How can they be cross-eyed when they're far apart? What? Yeah, they can. They just have to look that way. One of, his, one of his eyes, got, he's got a googly eye, you know? He looks like so Sid one eye is off. Yeah, one eye's I mean, looking off. Is that the one one, one eye's looking like, like right up here, you know? That <laughs> <laughs> and so... The glasses... Hey, what's your glasses, do they hey, self-correct yeah, these yeah. eyes when he's... When yes. He's, when he's uh, That's part of the reason why he wears the sunglasses. One, to cover okay. up the eyes in general, but two, they're corrective lenses, right. you know? He, he needs them. He got them from a, from a wizard in the... Uh, who gives a shit land. Okay. All right, so before we go further, I think I'm going to take somebody and move him out Don't and, do put him and close the door. You can't well, do that he's to distracting him. everything. You can't do that, Dan. He's an American. He's he has my, rights. He has, my so do we. Yeah. yeah, we have our rights, too. He's just being a little too distracting and chewing on stuff. He's, licking he's, my, chewing on he's licking my sock right now. He was eating my shoe. Uh, that's disgusting. Yeah, no, <laughs> he was eating out. my shoes. Uh, that's nasty. That's All right, we'll keep him here wants. for a little longer. But if it becomes too... Yeah, he's, he's I think he wants my shoe. Don't give him your shoe. I think he's scared of I, I'm not wearing is them Is your anymore. shoe on your foot? Or is you, it, they were. He told, pulled it off? No, I took them off. Okay, right. doing what he was doing. All right, so here comes the difficult part. Now, we haven't been together for about four weeks. We've had a lot of things going on. Down. And, uh, and uh, so we have to do a recap <laughs> as to where we are in this down. Right. And... Uh, <laughs> Come here, little guy. Yeah, I think so. I think Come so. Go, go see uh, your uncle. Look. Yeah. Look, go show him cool. grandma. Keep going. Stay. Don't do anything. No, no, that, that's mean. We've got the fan going, so. Guy. That's good. <laughs> I can my shoes down. <laughs> Thank you. That's called taking control of the situation <laughs> for, for the better. He was, better he was just group. trying to be part of the fun. Yeah. All right. So who did the recap the last time? Does anybody remember? I did it. Fine. You did? Yeah. Okay. So yes, you did. It's good job. It, it's it's, that means if we're going in a circle, it's either Michael or Sarah. I think it's my it turn. doesn't have to be okay. me at all. So we're gonna. Do you want to try it? Do you want to give I it a shot? I will try. If there's anyone here that can do it, it's you, right? I, I think I have better memory of what happened than she does. <laughs> we do blew up. Jiminy blew up the caravan that was in front of the building. Jiminy Carlisle did. What, what building are you in? Uh, in the, front of? the tower. Uh, wizard's tower. The wizard's yeah. tower. Okay. He blew it up, so we lost everything that was good in that thing. We managed to find a couple of things, but we you lost. lost well, that's we that's lost that's everything. That. You lost everything that was good that and, day. And like that. more than half of us almost died. Grats <laughs> nearly insta died. Yes. It was a tough so explosion. we were going to leave. <laughs> Until <laughs> Jiminy caused a nuke to happen and almost everyone got down, so they went up back to the tower to rest for another night. Things happened. Oh, it's okay. Um, we lost all the good shit that was in that car. <laughs> Uh, and then Lazarus decided to stay out while everyone went to the tower because he was going to explore. And he found a man who came and said that his sister or his wife needed help. 
with him, and he didn't trust him. And uh, he shot the guy, I think. I don't remember how it happened, but the guy turned into a werewolf, and then he ran back into... Damn. Lazarus ran back into the tower, and now we're all in the tower while some of them are staring at werewolves and wolves, and then we decided to rest, and N and W and... Um, fuck, what's the girl's name? Irina. 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 They went to the third floor to sleep there while everyone else stayed in the other floor, and then two of them stay are staying in the second floor to look outside. And they went to go to sleep, um, but W noticed Irina was snoring and trying to keep him awake. And uh, <clears throat> she, so he went to try to quiet her down, pressed on the thing, unlocked a certain compartment, found some goodies in there. And then they went back to sleep. It. Right, I mean, you also, you, fit, you did start out, well, you did fight some e evil entity, you're calling it a lich, and you did beat it, yeah. which was a good thing. Slapped it in the face. It was a little rough, yeah, so, and you, you discovered some things, so, good things have happened. Oh, we talked to a skull, and he told us, we answered some questions. It was uh, a head, not necessarily a skull, Yes, right? a head. A head. Uh, it's a bust. He said there was an old not, man that was not good too. looking, no. saw them a little while ago, and cut his head off. And he said, Rudolph Van Richten. Yeah, Van Richten. So we have a theory he's alive. Or that okay. happened a while back. We then. have a specific theory on who it is. Wow. And which, who I is? still think he could be dead. That could have been a bit in the past. Yeah, but they mentioned that one chick was meeting up with the circus guy, right? Yeah. So, most likely the guy the monster hunter who the, the circus guy and the monster hunter are probably related because he literally has a ghost tiger in his fucking hair yeah that doesn't, that doesn't say anything and that's why we all think jiminy carlisle is actually secretly rudolph and Dick. if yes. he was secretly rudolph van richten i would break the contract and leave the souls transferred over when he died into Jiminy's body, and he's I, just I storing would, it. I would, I would, I would shit quit. Jiminy so Carlisle carries. carries Jiminy Carlisle carries the soul of Rudolph. I would go to Strahd's yeah. castle for employment. Deep. If he was my boss, it runs deep. Could run deep. I think that's pretty good. Uh, uh, recap. Is there any other little bit that anybody want to mention? There is a little something. Uh the wolves tried to break into yeah. the tower. They mm -hmm. hit on the exactly. door, and then the yeah. door zapped him. Right. Yeah. And so what happened to them? One died, the rest oh, ran off. They ran off. Yeah. One of them's dead, the rest ran off. Yeah. But you're, so you're feeling pretty good about that, yeah. right? Yeah. 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 Lazarus, uh, kind of following his instincts. Um, I threw a, a silver knife at the guy. Right. I had right. him, like, try to pick it up. But did, then... uh, did he tell you his name? You guys, do you remember that at all? Um, did he give you a name? Kirill. 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 Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's up here. He said he was a Vistani. Yeah, he well. said he was traveling from. Oh, he said he was traveling from Velaki, so we but asked him. But he didn't him what, recognize Annabelle's Arabelle's name. Right. Which made yeah. Michael suspicious. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, you did a pretty good job. All right. Is that good enough for an inspiration? Yeah, no, no, no. Okay. You guys did good. I mean, uh, I think, uh, you know, pretty much what we've. After spending so much time in the town of Velaki. And it turning into a shit show. I would say that you know, don't you feel pretty good about what you did in this tower? Yeah. Everything you accomplished. No, I mean I'm proud of what I did in Velaki. Okay, well I am proud. Good. We ended two two dictators. dictators. We ended two yeah. dictators yeah. in one Everybody's night. Dead. Yeah. yeah. And you ran, so we don't really know what happened there. We'll but, find out. You know, you'll we'll find out. Yeah, yeah, you can go back. I mean, right? What, what yeah, we'll back? go back. We'll, we'll, what's, we'll, yeah. Welcome to hey. the Milwaukee graveyard. Hey, yeah, 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 I would be a hero since I stayed and helped clean up. Jimmy you Carl, you did get an inspiration for it, right? I give no, you I didn't get an inspiration for okay, it. Okay, then I will grant you an inspiration this time around because I was going to give you an inspiration <laughs> for being so smart with mm -hmm. the werewolves we'll try this it. time. No, and we have So some. give yourself an inspiration. Okay. And I have to give an inspiration to Jimny for blowing up the wagon because right. that's what Jimny would do. Exactly. I was going to So I'll give one, you actually. an inspiration exactly. for that, yeah. too. Okay? Exactly. You didn't have to demand it this time. I didn't. Did he demand it last time? He was going. No. Yeah. He, he usually demands. Yeah, he's. He's proud. very demanding. I need a okay, my dice. I don't know what my dice are. And by the way, if His you guys don't like any of the inspirations I put hand out, you can take. Yeah, it. I can right. hand it here. His okay, dice so uh, this. So you guys are uh, gonna go ahead and heal all up. Yep. And rest that night. Now, ultimately, where is it you're trying to get to? Crest. 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 And that is a city that you haven't been to yep. yet. Mm -hmm. um, and. 
Why are you trying to get to Crest? We are going to meet with the bishop or priest in the monastery. Okay. He's a high position of power. Oh, that's not your And what's your reasoning for doing that? To leave, uh, to leave Irina under the protection of a man of faith. Okay, and why are you doing that? This is the whole Because she's being hunted by Strahd. Because he loves her, because she's possibly a past because she's hot. Incarnation, incarnation. To be fair, they just want to wife. abandon her. Of, of, well, not his wife, of his to be <laughs> yeah, want to be her. lover. Yeah, yeah. But we also are going to see if we could find someone to help the town of Alaki because their priest died. Yeah, uh, yeah. Just and, looking for a replacement. And sure. Madame Eva let told us there is something in the good. far west that Very we believe good. is in Velaki. Yeah, yeah. True. so um, Madame Eva. you believe is in Velaki? I mean, Kresk. Madame Eva. Okay. And what would that be? So Madame Eva, as you're looking it up. Madame Eva is a Vistani seer who you read some cards, and it's it's probably a good idea to, to pull some of that knowledge. Stuff. Knowledge tells okay. us of history. Okay. You know how I got what you seek Madame lies Eva. in a town knowledge. far to the west, in a treasure chest, be, treasure chest beyond the confines nope. of. I'm world. here in my car, in my Bugatti. <laughs> Look yeah, my under Bugatti. the gaze of the morning wind. What is that? It's obviously a comedy routine that I don't so know. So we need about. to it's find a statue to to fucking, uh, of the morning lord and look in the ground. So we got to bury. So I'm sorry. Hold on, Sarah. Say that again. Uh, what you seek lies in a town far to the west, in a treasure chest beyond the confines of land. Look under the gaze of the morning lord and reach for the dawn. And his reach for the dawn. So when we go to Crest, we gotta find a statue of a man looking down and dig in the ground there. Man, if we had a cleric, he could have cast a daylight. I would have been so. If useful. I had a coin for every person I've seen looking down. <laughs> How many statues have you seen looking down? A lot. <laughs> of okay. a morning lord. So, in in sort of Don't a sort of a recap the too, mm -hmm. there is you are searching for certain things to help you. Yes. And those things, as defined by Madame Eva, are to help you to kill leave him. Barovia. The only way to leave Barovia is, to kill is probably to kill Strusel. Or to have a oh, nice. I just said Strusel. Or to have a nice engaging dinner party. That may be part of it too. There may be different angles. Yeah. You never know, right? Yeah, exactly. You know. Exactly. You know? uh, yes, so. I say when we go to dinner, we gamble. So that's to get one the of the things that dragon. came up, right? And it, you should talk about that. He did provide an invitation. Mm -hmm. Straw did show up in Velaki. Mm -hmm. He extended an invitation twice that's right. to Jimny. Because Jimmy Some is point such a take it up. personality. Maybe after class we can take the invitation. He sees Jimny and he knows what he wants. No, I yeah. want to do the. Yeah. Uh, he wants some good dinner. He wants a good dinner uh, dress. Somebody who's going to actually yeah, eat we could do that. that was prepared. So, somebody's going to appreciate the cuisine. Exactly. And the, the food and drink. Well, you know, someone you know, who might even be, able, someone who exactly. might be able to conquer the, the toilet, finally. Conquer the toilet? Yeah. yeah. Remember I was talking about the thunder the toilet. toilet. The toilet that people can't shit on. Yeah, the, 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 mm -hmm. the toilet that, that you I don't remember uh, that. Is that yeah, it? Yeah, that's one of Jiminy's uh, failures or some shit like that. I don't remember what it was. Oh, but it was uh, the forgot. secret toilet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jim, oh. Jimmy, in, in Strahd's castle, Jiminy okay. Carlisle failed uh, at, at a challenge of trying to sit upon the toilet and take shit into it because the toilet itself causes severe constipation. This was in Strahd's castle in Ravenloft? Right? Yes. So I'm sure Carlisle's, it was. Uh, Jimmy's been there. Yeah, Jimmy, Jimmy's been there. He's Him and Strahd are on uh, salad terms. You know, they, they meet each other every month and get a salad on a Sunday. <laughs> okay. Well, all that's news to me. Boy, Whew. I'll have to go back and watch the, uh, the uh, video. Yeah, I, don't, I don't remember what the hell In the fact, though, those are out on it's YouTube. Here, I, we never, like I never burning. say anything about that. Something does smell what like it's burning. What are you smelling? Something smells like it's burning. Something smells like it's burning. Yeah, we do have good. two things open, so it might just be from somebody's back here. It, it might, might be, be a grill or a barbecue. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Well, if suddenly Unless there's fire like... or something, well, we'll all just get up and run. Yeah. And and that would be a great way to end yeah. the Curse of Strahd. Because <laughs> after all, you do set fire to everything. Okay, so the great synopsis, kind of great ideas of where you're going, what you're trying Shots to do, fired. what you're trying to accomplish. So, all right. So, um... Yes, Ted Bishop from Accounting tried to conquer the cursed toilet. Yeah. Yes. Ted, Ted Bishop, Bishop from Accounting. Yeah, from Accounting. He's Strahd's Accounting. He's Strahd's Accounting. It was when we were creating the house rules, and that was the uh, question, what challenge were you guys unable to complete? Yeah. yeah. And I don't remember yeah, that. Yeah, Strahd has an accountant. Who else is going to manage the, the taxes? All right, exactly. I don't remember that at all, but that's It's fine. Ted from Accounting. Yeah, yeah, the toilet did kill Ted from accounting. All right. So, uh, so tell me what you're doing. It's the morning. Uh, I assume you're going to spend the whole night there, or do you want to leave during the evening? 
We are nice. spending the whole night there, and we're leaving in the morning. Leaving okay. in the morning. Better leave in the morning than at night. Yes. Even if- okay. So the night passes. You all are are healed up. You got your spells back. And Woo! And, I mean, I know you have all of three, right? Or yeah, something all like of that. two. All of two. Yeah, all your elders blasts. Uh, elders yeah. blast right. Elders blast left. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, so you tell me. What, we're going what's to out tower, and we're going to Kresk. Okay. And uh, you're just you're just gonna wake up. Okay. Yes. So you go outside, and you notice as you're outside. So you know that the there's been no disturbance, nothing. Uh, and as you've been in this tower, you have noticed that there's you can't Lazarus noted. Uh, you can't use any magic. Magic mm-hmm. just doesn't work. You walk outside the tower. Sky is as bright as it's been as you have ever seen it in uh, Barovia. Now it's it's not sunlight or anything like that, but um, it's the, a full moon. It's, it's a it's a nice morning. It's chilly. Uh, it's brisk. It's probably low 60s. So it's a lot cooler here mm. uh, than it was in Velaki because as you've been walking, you noticed that you are starting to walk in an incline. All right. So to leave the castle, you're going to have to go or the tower. You're going to have to go back across the inlet, which is part of the lake, and it sticks out into the lake. Uh, as you walk outside, you see there's obviously streaks of where there's lightning has struck right in front of the door, and you see a pair of legs that are there, mm-hmm. and they are just now sort of part of a sort of a torso, the bottom part of legs, and sort of this guy didn't have a flat butt like uh, Gretz, yeah. but he now not, doesn't have anything above his waist, and Gretz does, so Gretz is obviously in a better shape. Gretz, oh, yeah. there's breakfast. Yeah, Gretz is going to pick up a piece. And you notice that. Uh, there's a sort of an, a whole. There's a lot of mess of stuff around. There's like paper get, and junk like all from over from the, the, the explosion, and again you over to your left as you're starting to leave. Can I can I ask a question? Mm, yes. So you know how werewolves bite other werewolves to become a werewolf, other people. Uh, yes. If you were to eat a werewolf, would you become a werewolf? Um, that's a good question. I would say no. Okay, that's good. Uh, no, I, Gretz, as long as you cook it, it cooks out. Okay, Gretz wants a, taking a leg with him. Okay, you want to take a leg with you. Yeah. Okay, all right. It's now, already been roasted. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah, it's it's pretty pretty fried up. Yeah. I mean, the whole body's fried up. <laughs> yeah. So it's it's almost like it's almost like a it's space like, food. It's like Gretz's favorite food. Okay, Half. that's fine. You can. Um, it is still sort of in werewolf form. Yeah. So it's all burned up and stuff because it yeah. had hair on it and yeah. it burned up. Yeah. You're only gonna take one. Yeah, I'm okay. not. I'm lucky. Gretz don't want to gain the He's leg. He's not a barbarian. Yeah. Well, the thing is, you're gonna have to pull the leg off. That's fine. I gotta because yeah, you've got a. You're gonna hack at it. Yeah, I'm gonna hack at it. Okay, so everybody can watch as Gretz is hacking away, and it just takes a couple of hits for him to hack at a leg. So Gretz is now carrying a bust in his. <laughs> oh, I forgot we brought you got that. Busty in your in your backpack. Yep. You've got uh, <laughs> pen, pen, um, Piddlewick in Piddlewick. his spirit. And his piddle wick's on your back, right? He's on my front one. now because the bus is on the back. Okay. Yeah. And now you got a big, huge leg. Yeah, I'm eating it. Well, you're going to eat it as you walk. Yeah. Okay, well, that's okay. That's good. Sure. Sustenance. Yeah. I guess. So you notice that it's it's very smoky flavor. Mm. Yeah, it's the best flavor. It's sort of hickory. It's really... Mm. Roll, a, roll a 20 for me. 14. Uh, so you, you really actually think it tastes pretty good. Yeah. Now, uh, you know, everybody's looking at you. Everybody else roll a 20? A one. Three okay. and an eight. Okay. No, three and a six. <laughs> 18. Okay, so the only person that is envious of you eating that leg is Jimmy Carlisle. Really Everybody <laughs> else <laughs> is disgusted. That makes sense. Jimmy Carlisle. That adds up. That adds up. That adds up. Really wants it. Jimmy, Jimmy's at, at Grunts' leg, kind of pulling on his pants. Like, hey, Grunts is going to bring the leg down so he can get a bite. Grunts is playing down so he gets a bite. Yeah, Jimmy's going to Oh, you're going to give him a bite? Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. very nice. Okay. Jimmy mm-hmm. will take a bite. Share. That's yeah. good. Yeah. Uh, Jimmy's not against Well, it tastes good. Yeah. yeah. If you're too afraid to eat something's flesh, then why are you eating anything at all, right? Marina sees no sense in what you're doing. So she's. Well, she's actually kind of. She doesn't see sense in what I'm probably kind of disgusted. She's kind of disappointed in Jimmy. Since Little Miss fucking one. prim and proper princess. Jesus All Christ. Right. <laughs> this woman can't yeah, have see? any goddamn fun Gret- in her Gret- entire life. lived in a land where people <laughs> starve to death every fucking day. Yeah, Jimmy Carlisle is a connoisseur and appreciator of all things fine dining. <laughs> now, this may not be fine dining, but he can still appreciate toasted, food. Toasted werewolf leg. Look, Gretz lived in... Look, Gretz lived in... With the hair... 
city. If you're not going to eat it, who will? Grot's <coughs> right? that are Grotz flying around. literally lived in a land with his people. It's not fair, where It was right? snowing all the time. It was cursed never to have food. And were werewolves exactly. regularly eat people. You probably ate a lot of werewolves. Yeah, I did. Yeah, okay. That's a delicacy in his He ate sushi country. there, now he's eating pit Sushi, roasted. yeah, sushi. Yeah. That's a, this is a type of sushi for you. Okay. Well, so I thought sushi was raw. Yeah, he ate raw werewolves in the this tundra. Yeah, I did. All right, so you guys go back to the road that you got were on. Got a man's got to eat. And uh, this was a path that you took through to get here. And so you, you could follow. I'm assuming Jimny's going to be your lead. Yes. Jimny the lead. is perfect. Please. And it, so the path is, is the path itself is... You know, it's uh, it's covered in grasses, and the woods are invading it. But Jimny has no problems navigating Jimny's you never back had a through to bring you back to the Svalich Road, which is the major road that you turned off of because you were you felt like you had a presence that was following you. It's true. Turned out, guess who? Yeah, you did have somebody following. You. So um, this road is rough again, and you can see that there's some wagon wheel marks in the ground, but not many. They're 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 they're. Uh, so Jimmy can kind of follow and tell you that um, while there's there's definitely ruts in the road, they're not new. It's been a while since they have been put there, and the ground is hard and it's cold and rocky. Some some places that you come across, the trees have fallen down. They've been moved to the side, so you can tell that people have been coming through. But you are now walking on an incline, and Jimmy, you're feeling like really weighted down like it's really heavy and hard for you to walk okay, okay. it's just a lot heavier for you than normal he's just gonna start crawling you can crawl that's fine sure he's crawling. so as you're moving along it's starting to get colder the air is starting to get colder you can tell and now that you're away from the tower the the, the weather has turned a lot sour mm -hmm. as you were going through that path and it was covered Everything was fine. Yep. It was nice. The weather seemed like it was much better. But as you've gotten back now to the path and out, off the path of the road, it's a lot colder and it's a lot darker. Home sweet and home. And now they're starting to be, yeah, well, especially for you because you're getting little drifts of snow, little droplets of like flakes of snow sort of swirling in the air. There's no snow on the ground, but as you're walking, you're seeing that the trees are changing to more like um, spruce and cedar and like evergreens and like pines. So they're definitely a different type of tree. So the foliage itself is more thicker and denser. Um, the ground is littered now with leaves and there's like conifers. So you're starting to see like cones and things like that that are on the ground. The trees are thick. Some are like 10 to 20 feet um, spread between the larger, which seem to grow. And they're growing really tall now. They're like growing like what looks to be like 100 feet tall. Everything's starting to reach up higher, which is starting to block more of the sun. Even though it's the morning, let me just quickly roll. So I'm going to say you got out at about 8.30, 8-ish, mm -hmm. 8.30. You guys got up a pretty good time and ate your breakfast. So you can see that the trees are rough. The bark is rough on the trees, and it's like deep brown, and you can sort of smell that distinctive spicy aroma. Um, the silence, though, is like deafening. It's like there's no birds. You don't hear any like insects. You don't feel sign. anything. All you hear are your footsteps as you're kind of moving along. So how quickly are you guys moving? What rate do you guys want to move at this point? So you can go fast, like you're running. You can go at a fast walking speed. or you. And as you're moving in these distances, you're not going to be na noticing as much around you, and you're not going to. Obviously, the faster you run, the more likely you are to get. Uh, you could get attacked by something. Something could. I would. I would you. say we're probably going at a decent regular pace, like not not fast. We're not running. We're not rushing to get there. Yeah. It's like a march. Like yeah. A march. Okay. Like so a it's a steady, but you're you're going. You're not going slow. No. Like no. you're not investigating as you go. Right? No. No. Okay. All right. There's, Why there's would really. You? There's no, there really is no There's reason no, to. Yeah, it's not necessary. Yeah, Why would well, we unless do we pass by like an interesting. Yeah, so, uh, unless we see like a totem. But you still If we see like the world's things. largest shoe, then we'll stop. Yeah, yeah. Okay. where's the okay. big okay. ball of yarn, you know? Yeah. Well, you're the, the guy that's leading. So yeah. if something like that comes up, you're going to notice. Yeah, exactly. You're going to run okay. to it. So you do notice, Jimmy, you do notice that 
as you guys were going from Velaki to the tower, you, you would hear animals moving occasionally, like twigs, and you heard growling, and you that's how you knew something was kind of following, but exactly. here there's nothing. It's it's like, it kind of makes you nervous, and you're certain exactly that, there's, there's, that you're being followed. It almost it, feels like you think you're are being on, followed. The trees are is on it, his side, obviously. Maybe it's because you guys I'm, are eating the werewolf. He <laughs> is in the It doesn't wind. help you're chewing on a werewolf. I'm though. having my hand fly. You make it sound like that's a bad thing. I just did a very, very bad, bad post. Okay, all right. About the trees. Okay. I am the lyrics. I speak to the trees, and they're fucking speaking Vietnamese. <laughs> so the room is bad. curving slowly to the north, <laughs> and and you can hear sort of the faint. Eventually, you start hearing a trickling of water. It's off to your right, and the the wisps of snow are starting to come a little bit more. And it's definitely more gust of wind. It's breezier. It feels like it's dropped. The temperatures drop maybe about five to ten degrees. So as it curves ahead of you, there's a turn in the road, but there's no there's no sign that tells you what to do. So um, as you go up there, there is a turn. There is another road that goes. Oh, branching path. Hold on, let me pull up. Uh, you guys have do you guys have a map? Yes, yeah. Um, what? I can pull up a, a map too. It is. Yeah. A song. Yeah. It's like a Pokemon. Yeah. Who's that Pokemon? Or is it like shiny strud? That's count one count. Or is it like, yeah. or is it like Mickey Mouse where you notice three circles and stuff? You notice. I think, he's, I think he's more like the Mickey Mouse where you just see him everywhere. Yeah, he. Just, he's he on your coins. He's, 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 he's carved into the tree. Yeah, you just randomly see him peeking through the bushes. You can see the straw deck. You see the little eye heart chimney. Yeah, you see him do the little heart thing to Irina in the distance. Yeah, he's he's a sim for sure. Yeah, I got a feeling someone's watching me. So yeah, this no is privacy. sometimes this is you look in the mirror and you think, damn, I look good down, today. But it's actually just a road watching you through the mirror. And so yeah. you come to this sort of, uh, you hear the water coming up beside you, and you can see sort of ahead of you where the road a continues. Bridge. And um, there's a road that goes to the left, but it's much smaller, and it doesn't display much traffic, especially wheels, the car wheels. Okay. So the car wheels seem to at least be a couple of weeks old, and they seem to go to kind of to your right. So, oh, I'm, right. I mean, Jimmy, roll, roll, roll <laughs> a 20. 10. Okay, so on a 10, you feel like you guys want to stay right. So you can tell everybody that okay. if you want. I was going to leave it up to the dice, but I guess we'll stay right. You know, three lefts make a right. Exactly. So you can tell that there's traffic that goes in this direction, Jimmy. Mm -hmm. And, but it's obvious that it isn't heavily used every day. There's not a lot of people anymore. You know. It's cold. Now, on the side of the road, as you're looking, you see some animal tracks, too. So, are you going to look gonna, at them? Yeah, I'll look at them. I'm going to go up to them. I'm going uh, to identify the shape. Uh, I'm going to lick them a little bit and smell them a little bit. I'm so, gonna, you can tell they're wolf tracks. I'm, uh, oh, these are wolf tracks. Oh, God. And yeah, you can set, tell that there's more than one set. There's at least seven of them. Do you see that's a good, four that's a good paws? Go with that. Grotz is going to put down the leg, and he's going to put the foot on the space to see if it matches, kind of. Um, is going the, your to, foot is bigger. Okay, they're not werewolves. Jiminy is going to uh, try and identify how long <laughs> they've been there by licking them. Okay. Is it warm? <laughs> yeah, is it warm? How 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 okay. how solid is the the the, the ice? Or the Humidity also matters. matters. Yeah, you know. Is, is, uh, is there pee? Uh, uh, yeah, He's got to taste the pee. Nineteen. That. Oh, is, I okay. Mean, so you can tell that they're fairly fresh. These are the freshest these, tracks I've ever in tasted. In fact, you can tell. That in they, fact, they're right over there. You, no, they're <laughs> not right there. But you can tell that they have been made like just like maybe hours ago. This is at uh, least not two and a half hours old. Not only that, but you can see oh my God. that they have gone into the road. Oh, so you can tell they've they gone. are so, not afraid. So of you sort of follow like it across roads. intuitively, and you see that they've crossed to the other side. Oh, and now you can tell that there are tracks on both sides of the road. Oh shit! That's how well you rolled. Yeah. You can tell. Jimmy Carlisle is going to relay all of that information because that's a lot for me to say. Okay. You already said it. I say you we can even you you can even tell that there's a hint of dried blood. Oh shit! Even they've, though there's no eaten. discoloration. No, oh, Jimmy's gonna lick the blood. So you know that whatever they were hunting, they caught. Jimmy's gonna lick the blood. I want to see if I can identify the animal that they hunted. Okay. That's fucking. It's okay if you feel Grunts has more experience. Good or bad? Where is it? It's under the future. chair. You can't use yeah, that's the dice. Not good. That's, that's, not, that's, that's, that's off the table. That's out of one. 
A one? That's a one? Yeah, uh, well, oh, fuck, it was a 17 on the ground. No, never mind, 17. No. Well, we don't know that. Oh, it was a seven. So we'll go with the one. We'll go with the one. Yeah. Okay. Well, Jimmy All you can tell the is that, the, that they, the hunters got they got their prey. Yep, that tastes like blood. So you know there was some prey, <laughs> and they were hunting, and they separated. Mm, it tastes like caught. iron. Mm. Okay. All right. Jimmy's so immediately to... in front of you, Jimmy, as you're looking and you're making this decision, you guys exactly. can see exactly. he's kind of moving back and forth. You look up and you can see what is in front of you here, what looks like a stone bridge. And it looks like it's fairly old. There's gargoyles, again, just like you saw Shit. back at the one river, uh, the, the uh, river, uh, Seer River, uh, where you where you first came in and out before you saw where you saw Madame. Grudge, Grudge is going to shake his these. leg menacingly at them. Jimmy is going to throw a rock at it. Okay, as you're looking at them, this, this set have stones in their eyes that look like they're like, jewel? like yellowish. Yeah. Oh shit, that's okay, awesome. That's, so do you want to throw a stone at them? Yes. I want to throw a stone at the bridge, not them. Okay. Oh, before you cross the bridge. Yeah. See if they're activated does. by... Okay, go ahead and, and, and roll. Let's just make sure you don't throw it in there. Maybe if we show the invitation Ten. from Ten? the okay, devil. I just, I just want to make sure you didn't hit them. Mm. Or hit okay. them. So your, your stone hits sort of the the, uh, the 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 stone on the on that starts on the the bridge itself. Yes. Now everybody can come around the the, the corner of the corn sort of the corner and see. So it's up to everybody else. Tell me what you all want to do, and I'll tell you what Irina does. Do we have to cross the bridge to get to Crest? So Irina yeah. draws her sword. You could swim across the river. She's going to draw her sword. Gr Grudge is going to pull out the invitation with the seal from Straw. You're going to shake it up, try. Okay. Here you are, let's pass. Okay. Yeah, that's, um, a, that's a smart so thing. Yeah, yeah, we're, about, we're gonna, bros with your bro. So shut say, the fuck, don't fucking hit us. I'm, I'm going to say a couple of hours have passed. Do you still have your wolf leg, or did you eat it? I eat it. You eat it. <laughs> not the foot, though. I don't eat feet. You don't eat feet. Of course no, not. I still have the foot. I just don't <laughs> eat the feet. You're discriminating. Yeah. Uh, uh, you have discriminating. The feet's etiquette. too tough. The, yeah, the foot is for later. That's so did you throw it away? Or or you still no, I have it. On the toes. You still have it. Yeah. That's the toothpick. All right, okay. How else was I able to tell it wasn't werewolf tracks without the foot? Okay. All right, all right. So you're still holding on to that. Yeah. Okay. So you are you got a foot dangling in your hand. Yeah. And everybody I'm just going to cross with my sword. Grouch is going to cross with the invitation from Strahd. Okay, give me your marching order. I'm going to stay where I am on the bridge. And we'll go first. Okay, so you're going to stay at the front of the bridge? Yeah. Okay. I'm actually going to send my imp over the bridge. Which is invisible. That's cheating. So you're just going to fly him over? Yeah. I'm just he just over. flies. Does he fly through them? Yeah. Through? Does he? How high is he? He's just going to fly level with them. Level with the uh, the, the, two, the gargoyles. Yeah. Okay, so he just flies across. Okay, and as he flies across, what you see on the other side is you can see sort of an open pasture. Mm -hmm. and you see some sheep. Holy shit! Okay, guys can get close. And we'll go first. Okay, oh, be so careful with those go. sheep. You can I saw to... wolves. Those could be wolves. Oh, I know what it is. You can go two across. I, if you I think it attacks people okay, affected uh, with werewolf. And like W will go across. Which is why I asked you if you had the leg on you. Okay, Irina. Russ is going to throw the foot into the leg. You're going to pollute the leg. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Wouldn't you? This it's I'm feeding light. the fishes. I'm this beautiful leg. Look, you feed the fish. All right. Okay. Then you get werefish. Yeah. All right. No, that's so that's a real twenty for me. So I've got N and W, and then I've got Lazarus is lagging behind. Grutz will be at the Jimmy, rear. Uh, Irene is going to go behind uh, N. Okay. Jimmy? Uh, Jimmy will go after that. Okay, that basically is everybody because... Wildly? Well, Grutz, you're gonna, Grutz is going to... Grutz, gonna Grutz is taking the rear, yeah. Okay, okay. While they cross, I'm going to look behind me, away from the bridge, to make sure there isn't anything following us. So roll a 20. Okay, uh, which dice do I want to roll? Let me roll this one. Uh, 12. Is this a particular check? No, you're fine. Okay. Okay, I just want to make sure you're observant and you're, you're okay. watching whatever is going on. But you're focused that way. Yeah. Okay, so as you guys start going over the bridge, um, N and W are you know, moving across. There's no movement. The water is just flowing underneath you. Um, it's sort of meandering. It's like See, it's Grutz intimidated it's not, The river's not moving fast. Grutz tosses his leg into the river, 
and you see the leg just kind of splash, and it kind of goes down. It sinks. Okay, the foot takes it down. It's not a very flamboyant uh, foot. It's a heavy foot. So as you're looking, as you're moving up, you moved up sort of the, the so that the bridge kind of spans upward. So at the top, as you are looking behind you, as you look around, you just barely see in the distance the top of the tower, the wizard's tower you spent the night in. Um, the bridge is actually quite quaint. It's kind of it's kind of eluding this sort of sense of tranquility. I mean, you've got this nice, simple flowing river. The sides of it have like lush sort of grasses that are deep and growing and such. So ahead of you on the left, as you're moving, you start to see the pasture with some of the werewolves. You're starting to come down to the backside. The backside on the other two sides, you see also some gargoyles. Do you want to just keep going? Yeah. Okay. So everybody keeps going, and they go to the other side of the bridge. The imp goes to the other side of the bridge. Okay. You also can now see as you come to that end, you can see there's another windmill. This oh, is a much no. smaller windmill than the other one. Maybe one there's only one hag in this one. This one is functioning, only one hag. It's weathered, but um, the sails are do spin, whereas the other one, they didn't really, they didn't move. They're, they're kind of moving leisurely in the breeze. So you can see that the sheep are just grazing in this grass. Tuna's gonna go poke with the sheep. The riverbank, the, the you can you hear noise, but it's just the reeds and mm -hmm. such that are in the that are gently swaying. Give me one. As me. you're coming across, go ahead and roll a twenty, everybody. Hell yeah! Watch me get that. Okay, one. seventeen. 19. Both thirteen. You're still on Nine. The other side. You yeah. want to turn around? The Nine. Yeah, Nineteen. Sure. Two thirteens. Okay, so Got as you guys are walking across, do you want to go across? Yeah, I'm going across. Okay, so you can start going across. You, you you notice as you're coming along and you're moving across this as well. You all see a figure coming out of the windmill. It's coming up towards you, and you can tell that it is a young, a young lady. Gross is going to shout. I didn't throw anything in the lake. Foolishly, <laughs> I didn't. I didn't. I did not. Uh, <laughs> is that right? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, here you guys are. I should have shown this. Foolishly. You went across. Nicely. Are the lights pumpkins? Yes. No, the lights That's are the... Oh. You know, as soon as I get used to working with this thing... Something fucks it up. Fucks it up. Okay, so let's move you guys back a little bit and see. So you can see the sheep. So here's the sheep off to your. Oh, line is it going to be like a wolf in, down? in sheep's clothing kind of thing? That's what I just said. I was checking the sheep. Are you checking out the sheep? Yeah. Do you speak of animal? Are you going to break away from the group and go look at the sheep? Yes. They're just in a pasture. It's, 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 it is a fenced pasture, so I I might have it the sheep are it. locked in, and you can see that they're like bales of some hay that are sitting around. Do you need Carl on top of the fence? Huh? Jimmy Carl on top of the fence. Wouldn't it be easier for you to go under? <laughs> I don't think he could fit. Why not? He might get it's too fucking round. Feet? It's too He's round. Oh, he can't duck. Can you can you bend over? <laughs> uh, it kind of rolls. <laughs> <laughs> okay. As soon as so, he tries, he just tells. Okay, so do you want to? You tell me. How do you get over the the, the fence? Uh, Jimmy hops over. The fence is at least five feet high. Jimmy can hop five feet. He's got a dexterity of 20. Go ahead and roll a 20. He's got a dexterity of 20. Why do you keep rolling off roll roll the table? What did you roll down there? It's an 8. All right. Okay, so you jump Jimmy, over. Jimmy jumps 8 feet in the air. Whoa. And as you jump over and you go over, the sheep kind of kind of, kind of, of move away from you a little bit. I'm going to go towards... Uh, go to the biggest And you can one. see this woman is coming out, too. Certainly. I don't care about the woman. I want to go talk to the sheep. I'm going to speak with animals. I want the sheep. Okay, so uh, I'll, I'll, before we, we go to him, so this woman walks up to you and you Hello, can Hello, good evening. She is actually uh, a, a, an or attractive looking woman. Well, roll for hotness. Okay, she, roll for hotness. So I'll roll. roll. For hotness. 18. Okay, oh. 18 is good. Yeah, that's, pretty good. good. that's a 9 out of 10. What did you guys roll? How old is she? I got a 15. But I got a 16. Hmm. The, the, the next most important hmm. question is how old is she? Well, when you're looking at her, you can tell she's somewhere in her 20s. Okay. So she's blah, not, blah, not a MILF. 
Jiminy only likes right, She's very attractive. I only need mommies in my life. She might be a mom. So, See, that's the problem with Irina. That's true. <gasps> Irina's so she, not a mom. That's yeah, why Irina's he doesn't not like her. She's not a mom. Yeah, immediately gone. She's not, not a mom. Is that why you didn't uh, share? Yeah, you're a weird little guy, that's for sure. <laughs> he's well, definitely so, a little guy. guy. He, he, he likes, he likes, that, that, is the best way he to likes that milk. He <laughs> wants the mommy. You're a very strange little man. Okay, so milk. you guys all, as a group, want to walk towards her? Yes. So, uh, Irina is talking to you all, and she says, um, she just whispers as you're walking up, um, this is strange. Living out here in the middle of nowhere? Don't you think this is strange? I don't know. I think it's a quite the nice place. Look at the sheep. So you think she's just a, a shepherd? Well, you know. I didn't say that. Oh, okay. That, those hags. Oh wait, I wasn't. Maybe she's hags, a witch. So I, she could be a hag. So Irina says, "I will put away my sword, but we should be on our." Guard. Yes, we'll be on guard, but I'll put my weapon away. Too. Grutz, is, Grutz, Grutz is gonna fly. Grutz never puts his guns down. He's always <laughs> equipped. I'm gonna have my imp fly over to her the windmill. Okay, well she's coming from the windmill to you guys. So I'm my imp she's ahead. she's uh, your what? I'm sending my imp ahead into the windmill. So you're going to send him, by, so the windmill is up here. Yeah. She's come down, so you're going to send your imp into yep, the windmill? he's going to break into the little windmill. fucking bastard. Okay. Uh, go ahead, let me see. Uh, so he's going to look around. Okay, so uh, roll a 20 and beat a uh, 14. That's an 8. Oh, I didn't beat it. Okay. So he can't find any way in. It looks like the whole thing's boarded up. Okay. Okay. So, before we talk to her, I'm dying to know what you're going to talk to some sheep. <laughs> so, let's go over to you. Jimmy's going up to the sheep. <laughs> the sheep, are, the right couple back. of them are, ba-ram you. What? I had to do that. I'm sorry. Ba-ram you. Can't ram me. I'm Don't you know that? Ba-ram you. No, what? Babe. Oh. Oh. <laughs> It's, it's not funny if you have to explain the joke. You guys are looking at me yeah, like, I don't what get the fuck it. is that? It's it. a movie. Last time I saw Babe, I think it was four. I think Babe was probably more Robbie and Wendy. Yeah. So. Okay, sorry about that. Right. When you were four? Yeah. Pretty sure, we wa- pretty sure we watched I, it in the, I watched the old van school. like at least once on a trip. No, you know what? I t- never watched them, Babe. You, I took you and Wendy to see it. Sure. Yes. You boys have never I seen it? No. Has I took you and I, I took you guys. I oh, I, I probably watched that one. It's like two or three. Yeah, you guys are probably. I know the three mice. Maybe I'm. Yeah, wrong. I know the mice. All right. All right. Yeah. Someone's looking Yo. at you. Yeah. 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 Do you have speaker of animal? Yo. I do have speaker of animal. I use speaker of animal. I I mean you can cast it. I I you have it. Yeah. All right, what's your, go ahead. What's your game? Ba. 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 What's yours? Jiminy Kaya. Can you see oh, Jiminy Kaya? Dear Should have been Beethoven. <laughs> Jiminy Kaya. That takes forever. <laughs> Where is your wool? Uh, Jiminy's going to look at your shirt. His brother. He's a nasty guy. Oh, nasty oh, head oh, head oh. They're looking at you. Ew. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> One of them says, you smell bad. Not as bad as you. Anyways, I'm here for information. You 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 look like the kind of guy who knows things. You talk too fast. Okay, you look like a guy with information. This is true. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Who's the lady? Guy. Who's the lady? Uh, hold on. Ovidia. What the fuck does that mean? What's Ovidia. She, 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 uh, she's hot. Does she have any, like, kids? She's hot. Yeah. <laughs> You're hot, too. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, 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 Harry yeah. Gutt. A- anybody else in the area? Your name is Harry Gutt. Does, does, she, does, does, does she have any family? Is, she, is there anybody else here? Or they just Old her? lady. That's it? Old lady. Is she hot? No. <laughs> <laughs> Old. <laughs> I think she's dead. One of the others yes. says, I oh. think she's dead. Really? What do you Got mean? eaten. Oh, what? Gone. What? I think she says she's gone. <laughs> you hear it here? You make this so much harder than it needs to be, dude. Very He's God. actually doing what it says that they're supposed God. to do. 
Haircut? Harry Gut. Harry Gut, that's your, your name. Your name oh. is Harry Gut. Okay, uh, 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 We like you, you stink. What's, what's her name? Ovidia. Ovidia. We said you dumb ass. Okay, okay, Ovidia. Uh, uh, <laughs> Come on. Did she take care of you? Is she your owner? Yes. Yeah, is she bad? Only when she kills one of us for food. Oh, jeez. But that's why we're here. How often does that happen? That's the life of Boy, a Boy, you're really accepting that, huh? <laughs> what else can we do? There's a fence. You can fight back. Can't climb. You can fight back. There's more of you than there is We don't her. fight. Go kick her ass. The more will we give her, the less she eats. <laughs> She's hot. If you're going to go, go with a hottie. <laughs> You said it, Harry Gut. <laughs> Why is Harry okay. Gut here? Okay. Why do you come and talk to us? Because you're important. More important than you know. Actually. What is what, important? Uh, what, what was your name again? Bob. My name is Ba. Ba? Oh, yeah, that's right. You're the chosen one. You're actually supposed to lead the rest of these sheep to what? out of here. Where? Freedom. What's over there? Grass. Hills. Sunshine. Bunch of hot chicks. Help us to get, get out. You have to go. You, there's a gate, right? You're the leader, Harry God. No, no, Take no, no, us. No, no. I'm only here to Take send us. you. Take us. We will follow I'm you. I'm only here to give you a message from God. They're all God. starting to crowd around you. We will follow you. <laughs> You're our leader. <laughs> They're all coming for you now. They're all surrounding you. You are our leader. No, no, Bob here. I love you, Harry. Bob, God. Here we go. What is Take us away. <laughs> <laughs> you look around. You notice that it's just a fence. There's no real opening. Oh. Help us, Harry. Save us. You have to learn how to jump. No. Yes. No. Four yes. feet on the ground. What? That's the best lesson. <laughs> Keep all four feet on the ground. No. We, you <laughs> how is it you can freedom. walk like you do? What? How can you walk on two like you do? Because it's, it's called power. Respect. Why are you so round? I eat a lot. Oh, do you eat sheep? Sometimes. Oh, they're starting to kind of walk away. Oh, no. <laughs> now they're kind of afraid of you. That's right, that's right. Yes, Boss yes, says, yes. you are confusing us. We are all only sheep. <laughs> what do you want from us? <laughs> We're just dumb sheep. What else do you want you. to know? She's I'm here to help you start the revolution. Fight for your freedom. Well, I am confused. You have to learn how to jump the fence. It Teach is your us. destiny. Teach us. Okay. Jimmy's going to get on all fours. And he's, yeah. he's going to do a little woo. Well, why don't you know They're watching you. Cry. He's going to do a little. It's like, going to be like a little. Boss looking woo. at you. Boss says. Oh, you're woo. jumping over the fence. Boss says. What is that? Dad, he's called jumping. Why? You get over the fence. Looks you like look. a lot of work. Okay. Here's the fence. Here's you. No. You go woo, and Show you're over the fence. Jumping over the fence. No. Jimmy's gonna go jump over the fence. Just, just watch. Just watch. It's okay. as easy. I as hope you're all right. I really easy. hope so, you So as you out. jump over the fence, Olivia's kind of coming up to everybody, and she's looking at. I'm gonna, you see, she's watching Jimmy. You're gonna you know, see me throw but you see, a silver good, point Jimmy at her. is. W wait a minute. Hold on. What? I'm gonna throw a silver point at her. She's, you're going to throw a silver coin at her. Yeah. At her face. At her face. Okay. Straight at All her right. face. All right. She's going to, let me see what she's going to take. Here. She's going to uh, kind of look at you and bend over and pick it up. And she's going to slip it in her top. Okay. Nice. Okay, not a werewolf. She lost but a silver She's coin. looking at you, kind of. It was worth it not to have a Jimmy's werewolf. Gonna, Jimmy's and she's gonna gonna on over. And all you guys hear are a lot of. <laughs> I'm used to this. <laughs> and from him, you hear a. <laughs> and they're like. <laughs> Jimmy's just trying to start so another animal. You see farm. him jumping over. He's jumping back and forth over the fence. So she approaches you all. And she says, Good uh, day. travelers. Yeah. Hello, yeah. travelers. Yes, yeah. I see. You test me. Yeah. You're a smart traveler. Yep, you're not a werewolf. And I'm a smart tra uh, smart living person who lives here. See, yeah. I tested myself by throwing the silver coin. You picking it up tests that you aren't a werewolf. Of course. I'm in agreement with that. That's what doesn't have to be tested. Where are you from? Uh, are you from Balaki? We came from Balaki. See... But we're not from Barovia. Gretz so. doesn't want to get tested because Gretz usually fails tests. 
She says, my name is Ovidia. What is your name? Uh, my name is uh, W. I. Your name is W? W. Or you oh, can call me William. No, I just I'll call, call you W, w if that's what you wish to be called. And your father? Uh, that's my brother. Oh, dear. Uh, his name is N. They started oh. late for the second one. No kidding. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you, Mr. Uh, I am Grotz Breaker. Oh, yes, that makes sense. Yeah. And the wise one. And I am Al. 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 Yeah. Okay. And uh, where are you all traveling from? Velaki. Uh, Velaki. Velaki. It is a hellhole. Really? Everyone's dead. Yes. Um, everyone is dead? An army of the undead came and killed everyone. Yes. You did? Yes. yes. She says, where are you fleeing? Yes. Yes. You must be headed to Crest? We are. Yes. We're headed to Crest. Oh dear. That is bad news. Yeah, yes. no, it's not. Very, very bad news. news. Yes. Have you been down to the wizards of wine? They're dead. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, no, no. We haven't gone down there yet. Everybody's dead but you. We haven't gone down there yet. Not yet. Do you know what's happened with the wine? They are expecting I, wine in Christ. I know that they're expecting wine. Your news is bad. Yeah, no, it's not great. They will news. not be looking forward to seeing you in the city. Nope, not at all. No. Trust me. That's how it goes, though. The life of any danger. You're over jumping yeah, back and forth over the fence. Oh my god. She's kind of, you see her, she's looking. She says, he's with you, right? Yes, he is. He's so, special. He is. He's oh, is special. Oh, is he touched? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Well, I'm wondering why he's talking to my sheep. He likes to talk to things that are smarter than him. Jenny is going to come <laughs> over. She's kind of looking at him. He's, he's, he's cute. <laughs> oh, I'm cute. He's cute in his own way. <laughs> he likes to talk to things. The sheep seem smart. to like him. <laughs> My sheep have a lot of personality too, so Jimmy, I can see Jimmy's why. He's gonna Jimmy's gonna stop. Jimmy's gonna Jimmy's gonna thumbs up. No, no the, I'm not. The sheep. I'm not telling you to stop. No, Jimmy's gonna thumbs up the sheep. He, he's giving them the instruction. They're all looking they very do. confused. Uh, this is what you have saying, to do. Uh, we to, can't jump like you. You can if you. No. You have to learn. No. Them you see them and they they're kind of going like this, but they can't. They they're like look. <clears throat> Sheep can they kind jump, of jump over fences. They kind of jump How awkwardly. How do you think they are. you're supposed to count sheep? They yeah, go they, over the fence. I One, two, two sheep, three jump, sheep, four jump sheep. That, that's in your dreams. Y you can do this. No. It's not just in my dreams to keep No, horse. we are supposed Jim, to be Jimmy's sheep. Gonna, Jimmy's going to touch him on the heart. We follow. No. We will follow you. The, the we can't jump. You we'll do anything to, you ask but jump. Look, you... How about we, we just like lay... No. We can lay down. You have to break no. free. You I were destined you. for this. You can jump. <laughs> you can that jump That fence too. is a fucker. J Jimmy's walking away from this. He's done. Right. He basically like, learned what he needed to You can see the sheep. You, draw, you walk away, the sheep are now yeah. like, they're kind of confused. So they're all looking at Bob. Bob's Bod. like, nah, 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 nah. So they all kind of All right, Jimmy's walking up to his, his good old pals with his new newly found information. So the sheep kind of, they, they're, they're going to they're gonna walk away. You, can't, you know the girl's name. Congratulations. Oh, I know more than that. I, I know at least two bits of information. Three. What's that? So the sheep are kind of well, scattering around. This, this is not that important. You don't need to move the sheep. All right. Jiminy's going to walk up to his, his good old friends, <coughs> his good old pals. Jiminy is going to announce and he's going to say, Well, unlike you fools, I have learned great and extensive knowledge from the sheep. What you like? could tell from the way I you were acting. Her name is, and I'm a point of lady. Her name is Ovidia, and she's good except for when she eats them. So she's and I'm looking right at her. Well, yes, of course I eat my sheep. I uh, yeah, and they know that sheep. you eat them. Yeah, I, I look. I they're like aware. Them. Jimmy, uh, you eat things they all the know time. This. You just he, ate a werewolf. They're not happy with you. You ate a werewolf? Yes, you did. Don't knock it till you try it. Ooh. Do I look like a man who you doesn't must have power? You and must respect. Be, you must be adventurers. Yeah. Of course I am. Look you're, at me. You are uh, mercenaries. I'm I came. I came from Verotsakov. You are very much correct. Yes, we are mercenaries. <laughs> it's a land full of werewolves. League of the Roses. You are killers. Yes, we're of killers. The roses. Yeah. I don't know what we, that we is. We are murderers, killers. Grudge is going to pose. Scary people you're, who will destroy. You're going to pose. Yeah, I'm going to pose like the sign. We are the heroes. 
Is there anything I can W's help you with? Gonna get on, he's going to do a Spider-Man pose underneath the grass. <laughs> yeah. And if you have any soup, gonna uh, up and some mutton, obviously you have some mutton. Uh, Jimmy's going to point at the Yeah. She's like, oh, yeah, you, you look good. Yeah. Thank really you. Good. Thank Jimmy's going to start flexing. Really yes, good. yes, yes. yes. I look fantastic. She looks at, she's looking at you. Yes. You're flexing? Yes. My physique is, is <laughs> undeniable. She's, she's, everything she can do to la- stop not laugh. <laughs> she looks mean. at uh, Irina and she says, "That's me." Are you, you you're traveling with them? And Irina says, "They're my guardians." Yes, Jimmy is your guardian. guardians. Guardians, your guardians. Yes, we're we're, an we're protecting her for right now. <laughs> Yes, we're like her Why escorts. are you protecting her? Jiminy is but a natural born I, escort says, guardian. I am, I am the daughter of uh, Koyanovich, the... the, the uh, Baron. Baron. We, we seem to be very wet lips about talking about a, stuff. Well, it's their daggers, <coughs> Irina. She's a sheriff. She just gives information for free, dude. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You told, you told her our life character. stories. Yes. She's, uh, she's okay. I understand. Sarah naturally gives away all the information about us. I yeah. do. She says, how long, Irina I'm says, this is, this how long have you lived here? And Ovidia says, I've lived here all my life. This is my uh, home. Do you have anyone else other than you? Uh, she says, sadly, my mother died a year ago. How oh, I'm sorry, are you? She know that, too. How are you and the sheep? Do you know that? Yeah. How are you and really? the sheep safe? Yeah. From the monsters. Well, I was just going to out. ask for your help. Uh, my sheep are dwindling. Oh, so they are being eaten. There's there's wolves that are that are attacking. I think. Have mighty. you ever thought of a wolf farm? No, they. I don't. A wolf. That would be farm? very difficult. I, maybe if I had armor like this one, but that's true. No, I I can't. But I I wonder if you could help me. Could you help me? Yes. Do you mind? Yeah. We you don't know, mind. I, it sounds like you've come from trouble and. Sounds like you're trying to. We're always willing to help someone in need. So that's that, what they're going to. I can't pay you very much, but there there seems to be a pack of wolves that are coming and eating my my sheep. They're dwindling in numbers. Would you be willing to help me? Yes. Oh, that's great. You know what? Why not? Fantastic. Why not give our help away? Well, I I can uh, <laughs> I can. Yeah, I'm gonna stay. You... Out I'm gonna stay out and as uh, I said They seem that. to come at night. So what I've been doing is I have been taking the sheep, some of my sheep, and actually putting them in the the. That's the probably the safest. You know, trying to keep them with me, but I can't take them all in there. It's a mess. You know, yeah. It's difficult. Can't you just pick them up and take them in? Well, it's that's what I do. Pick some them of them, in. but I had I had twice as many sheep as I have now. What? Well, some very, point. It's you'll very difficult here to, do it. to 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 raise. Food. Have you thought of building a barn? Can I I'm not. Do, I'm not a hunter. Can I do an inside check to, to see if I can tell if she's telling the truth or not? Sure. Okay. I have full faith in her. Jiminy I don't. believe her. Jiminy. Jiminy's not uh, a trusting a soul. Fourteen. So you feel good. Okay. She feels like she's she's being an sincere. honest gal. Okay. She Down says, uh, in, "I mean, I, I'll I'll try to give you something in." In, in as appreciation, if you can help me, can you just kill some of the wolves? Have you killed wolves? Yes, plenty of wolves. Oh, you look like, you're, you look like I you're just very ate strong. a werewolf. Yes, I heard you were eating a werewolf leg. I yeah. mean, how do you? If we kill them, how do you plan to prevent more from coming? Um, that's you, a good question. I'm hoping that if you kill them, they're put packed, the scores around. Material. If maybe we put the heads of the wolves around, that would help on yes. stakes. It's okay. like a danger. They're territorial, so they. You know, some would come back into this area, but if I could do something that, you know, you sort just of smear their blood and make sure that they know. Okay. And I'm afraid that it's probably more than just I wolves. have an idea. We put the skulls up and then we Gretz, on them. you pee next yeah. to them. So yeah. you dominate this Me? as your territory. No, Gretz, I will piss on them. He will piss on them. I will mark my sign. As his territory. He is, a bear, he is a bear lord. I'm a, I, I, I am one with the bears. He's a bear, man. And wolves fear bears. They do. He's I was bears. just going to say. Yeah. You do look a little bearish. Yeah, I'm hairy. I mean, I, I think I mean that as a compliment. Sure. I, I can feed you all. Um, I can feed you some fresh mutton. Yes, yes. Jimmy needs mutton. Okay. That sounds good. That's so Almost good. immediately. I'm willing to do that. And <laughs> okay. I don't have money. Um, so that's uh, fine. I, I'm willing to. True. Trade. So there's no there's no use in us robbing you, obviously. 
Oh, gee, I'm going to smack him. <laughs> and smack him, Jiminy. Don't listen to him. Thank don't wait last. I know he's tough. The last he's time. Touched. He's touched. The last time he yeah. he stole something. Well, he technically has to go take Jiminy's glasses off. What? You're going to take his glasses off? She's going to go. <laughs> We'll put him back on. Yeah, give him his back. Put him back on. Jimmy's going to kick him in the chin. <laughs> it was a little cute, but not now. Please. Jimmy's going to start kicking him in the chin. Yeah, he has the opposite the of when the man takes. That is a rude, rude thing. <laughs> so she says, Jimmy's going to take his pants down. You know, fuck you. <laughs> Don't worry. You can't take your pants but down. But you can't see no, anything hers, anyway. Hers, hers, hers. <laughs> yeah, fuck him. That's okay. So she says, so I'm Yeah, you shut up, a bitch. Come back to my... My uh, and and uh, my my uh, my windmill, hmm. and uh, let me know what it is you want to do. They okay. come they come every night. I hear them out there every mm-hmm. night. So I don't think it's you know you're not going to have to necessarily you know hunt them. They're going to come to you. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. And they usually come you know right after sunsets. They come you know ten o'clock at night. Means we'll have to spend some time together in the the, the, the windmill. That's but perhaps you oh no, we have to get to know each other a little more. Yes, that would be nice. I'd like to get to know you. Yes, yes, I'm Judy Carlisle, like, the greatest of them he, all. Does he like like soup? Of course, yeah, I like soup. Oh, <coughs> he'll eat anything. I can. Why are you acting like I'm shaking my head? Anything? Mm-hmm. Well, I'll try. That's to right. Eat. Give me a rock. I'll eat it. <laughs> I won't give you a rock, but I'll try to give you something nutritious. I have okay. some nutrition. Okay. That so she's had a vegetable um, so she takes you back into the windmill, and she serves, you know, for lunch, she serves you some stew. It's like a mutton stew. Yeah. And yeah. Such. And she's just talking to you, and she's, uh, so she says, uh, she trades with, she explains that she's like a trader of wool to both Kresk and to Velaki. And having learned, l- learned that Velaki has got problems, she's kind of worried. She's asking you, do, when do you think I should try to trade with him or do you think it's it's gone uh it's i would you. give it a couple i weeks. saw the male die i saw his son get chopped up i saw several people get killed by undead last time i saw if there's anyone left they're still running from well, the undead. So running based on your, so based on your skin this is a couple of weeks so she's saying but you still think people are alive right? yes. yeah oh god yeah, yeah. i'm gonna cut nope. in and say that while the rest of them went off I helped mm-hmm. clear up the most of the undead that were left. Oh, okay. Yes, Jimmy okay. Carlisle is fighting dead today before. Yeah, Jimmy Carlisle is okay. a little tired. There's going to be a new management, I think, though, if you come there. Yes, it'll definitely be a different Is band. there anything you want to ask her questions? Um, How is the city of Crest? Have you traded with them? Yes, Crest is a, a small city. It's not yeah. as big as Velaki. There are probably about 200, 250 people there. Yeah. Um, they have a big wall. They live behind the wall. They don't come out. They don't come out at all? No. Do you go in or do you trade out? I go out? in to okay. trade. They only allow... How are the people? Merchants. Are they happy? Are they sad? Um, they're they're, they're um, content. Content? Okay. I would say they're, they, they feel pretty confident hmm. because they feel pretty safe behind yeah. the wall. And you've heard of the abbot? Yeah. She says, do you know, do you know about the abbot? Her, her, heard of him. Her, he's a very he, much religious man. He's very religious. I hear he can resurrect the dead, and that he he just recently has. There's there's the news is that he has resurrected somebody recently. See, in, in this godforsaken land, I don't find that as a good thing. Oh, it's a good thing. It's a good thing. We need people with. He has very powerful. That's what I understand. You don't know He's what very very powerful. You don't know how they bring looking. them back. Pardon? You don't know how he brings them back. Are they normal when they're no, brought back? No, I don't. Have you seen anyone who's I been brought back? No, I'm not. I I have not. So a little sauce. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna ask questions. Uh, are, do you know what the sheep's have been dying due to wolves or werewolves? Well, I think it's war wolves, hmm. but. Um, there are big footprints. They could be so, le- led by a werewolf. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm gonna ask. Uh, it has there been any of like your fencing that's been broken or holes in them where it looks like a wolf might have dug through? So those are good questions, she says, and they do not destroy the fence. So they jump over it because I think they know that they can come back to this source for food. Oh, because so I'm, they let you keep them. So and they breed let me them. cultivate for a while, and then uh, they come. So they call they the herd and take every night. I shouldn't say they'll be here because they don't come every night. 
but lately they've been coming more frequently. The snow, she says, as you go up to Cresc, there's like no end. There will be snow. It is cold. Just like Verostica. The winter has hit very hard. I don't know where Verostica is. It's a place where there's no food, super fucking cold. Gus's ass freezes over every time So he's she there. says, so this time of year, I don't go to Crest much. It's too cold, too snowy, and is right now, this this, snow, this winter is very hard up there. Yeah. So I haven't been up there recently. Mm-hmm. That's why I don't know much about this resurrection have story you, that I've heard of. Have you thought about hmm. burning wolves, vein? Hmm. Like cultivating some wolves? That is a Vistani trick. <laughs> I don't follow Vistani. Okay. Uh, um, it's useful, though. Uh, I've not, I do not know how to do that. Oh. I don't know how to cultivate it. The, they are smart in how to find it. Mm-hmm. It's something that they, you have to learn how to distinguish and find. Okay. That's not my background. Mm-hmm. Are you Vistani? No. No. Okay. Well, a man, you don't a, look Vistani. A Vistani that, showed us The once. one that might be... Kind of, no, he's just special. Excuse yeah. me. I well, he's kind of. keep saying this. Jimmy Carlisle has an IQ. You think just you're special? Because you're kind I, you're of. Very Jimmy special. Carlisle has. Because you're kind of. Ruddy. Jimmy Carlisle has an intelligence of ten. <laughs> no, it's not that. It's it's because you're kind of. <laughs> but hey, he's I'm trying ten. to say it in a nice way. You're kind of like dirtier. Yeah. That's I'm not sure how to say. It. Oh, I'm sorry. You're, you're more of the earth. Oh, I'm sorry. You I'm trying only, to be nice. I've only had you live the life of a peasant. I'm oh, you poor thing! You're okay. having a whole fucking Here, I'll give you another bowl of Yeah, that's right. Soup. That's right. You give me another bowl of rice over. or whatever. You do look hungry. Yes, Jimmy. He looks hungry. like he eats you out of house and home. He yes. does. He does. Jimmy eats other people. He ate those guys in the garden. No, he ate no, guys no, for So here's here's the rule. If you don't feed him enough, he'll eat whatever you have lying I will around. eat everything. All those sheep outside, he, uh, I will do worse to you. One, one, one time. Well, your friends will One time. You from him, right? You won't let him. Okay. One time they didn't give him more food, and so he ate this butler's entire flower garden. Is it true? Well, fortunately, I don't have a garden for him to eat. It was a beautiful, beautiful garden, and I ate all the flowers. All of them. Eat something else. I don't want him to eat my 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 sheep. He was out there talking to my sheep. That's he right. Eat he them. Uh, he was friends with him. Didn't yes. He? Uh, I learned all about you and your dead. I wouldn't count on it. That was my mother. Sure. Thanks for bringing it up. Yeah, she's dead. So the sheep know about that, huh? Yeah, they know about it. Yeah, and they know that you eat them. I'm glad you you told me. They know that you eat them. They're not happy about that. Do my sheep know how to jump? <laughs> you know, is there anything I was trying like to find to that about? out to see if they could uh, yeah. band together and cause a revolution against you. Uh, it's definitely in the works. Really? Yes. <laughs> quite he tragic. Says, uh, quite tragic. It happens says, to all like, dictators, think, obviously. Got to make an example. <laughs> is there any anything else I can tell you? Uh, uh, she says, where Where have you been? In Barovia. Uh, the village of the Barovia. Village of Barovia. The Lockie. The Vlaki. I've never really been that far to the village. I hear it's dreary. Oh, it's very sad. Uh, very sad. They do a roulette when you die. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be offensive. It is dreary, though, I hear. Yeah. There's like, a, she's kind of looking at Lazarus like, what can I say? There's a death <laughs> roulette. There is? Yeah, you, get, you pull a card. If you get the shortest stick, you die. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That yeah. sounds really... Yeah. Bad. Yeah, management yeah. is really bad up there. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm glad I'm, I'm going to say Irina. Well, you I'm know what they happen. say? The farther says, away uh, you are from your boss, the better you are. That's why. Are, it's, are, you wouldn't happen to be going down to ever or know anything about what's going on at the winery? We don't know much about it, but we do plan on going. We over do there. plan on going because Gretz is nearly out of wine. He gets cranky without his alcohol. Do you know anything? Do you, do you know? Uh, well, do you know? The, I was just going to say, do you know who owns the the winery? No. No, I don't. It's owned by a, an old family, the Martikoffs. The Martikoffs. The Martikoff family. They've owned it for just like decades, hundreds of years. They um, they're very kind. They'll 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 deliver a bottle of of wine to me, and I'll of course give them some of my wool. Is trade. They're very kind people. Sorry. I don't know what that is. I think it's Mike. I hear him talking. Maybe we should take a break. <laughs> yeah. That's probably best. Okay. Because I don't know what's. So, so we'll be back in 10 minutes. It sounds, we're hearing some odd sounds. So we want to go ahead and take a break, and we'll be back. Oh, somebody did something. 
I think something, yeah, some somebody made a mistake. Repeat exactly. everything that you've said. Repeat everything that's happened. Uh, we so, we'll look for footprints. That's so here's a couple know. of the, the water pens. Which one do you want to be in? Do you want to be in this one or this one? That one. Are you one. in them? Yes. You're actually in the water. Yeah. Okay. I am a frog boy. I could breathe underwater. Oh, sure. Okay, that makes sense. And Ann is going to be here? That's pretty cool. Yeah. Right here, you've got some... some. Oh, and we'll go on that side. He'll guard... That way, both sides are guarded. Okay. Grats is going to ask her if she has are any Are you guys going to let Irina go out here, or what are you going to say? Grats is going to have... Maybe. Ask Olivia, do you have any unworked wool? Like, like you just sheared it, but you didn't do Why anything with it? Why don't you use your, your hair that grows? Only my beard. Only my hair. You. I'm going to have my imp stay next to Irina. I mean, I guess I could. I'm gonna use. So she's inside. Okay. My hair. I'm putting you on top. It's gonna be fucking weird. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking be so fucking weird. So what are you gonna do with your hair? So I have magic hair that can grow at will. I'm gonna have it grow really thick, like it almost like gonna look like sheep hair with an afro. But it's gonna continue to grow down my body. Okay. So I'm, I'm gonna act like a sheep. So you're going into the sheep to herd of sheep. Yes, I'm gonna act like a sheep. <laughs> Baa! <laughs> Is that what you're gonna say? Baa! Baa! So when you baa, most of the sheep sort of like go the other way. Baa! They kind of they kind of group together. <laughs> But they're trying to stay away from you. They're when ostracizing you the black yeah, sheep. You should they ram like one of them away. to prove you're the alpha. Yeah, Gretz is gonna Gretz is gonna fucking run into one of them. All right, go into the biggest one. Yeah, I'm gonna. Gretz is gonna find the toughest one in prison. So what does what does Jiminy want to do? Jiminy, is he gonna lay in their shit? <clears throat> That's a good idea, actually. Hide your son. Jiminy, go where? Lay in their shit. Jiminy is going to take all of his clothes off except his sunglasses. And he is going to be. Uh, I didn't know you had sunglasses. <laughs> so Jimmy's you're going to get on the floor in with Gretz and yes. be, be a sheep. Yes, Jiminy's going to go but on. But you all don't fours. look like a sheep. Yeah, you don't have the hair. Okay, just so you know. Bleh. Okay. He's right. a shaved sheep. Bleh. And you're covered in poo? No. Oh, okay. He's just How covered in brown. With his hair. He's got. A, he's a hairy little man. Oh, oh okay. All right. Okay. Bleh. Bleh. Jimmy's going right. to start eating the grass. Bah. Gretz okay. is going to follow him because he sees him eating the grass. Hmm. Okay. So, it's... Uh, Jimmy's going to go in the corner and take big shit. So, the night is... is, is you know what? <laughs> He's going to go in the corner and take big shit. Okay. <laughs> Where do you want to go? You want to go up here? Uh, yeah, right there. go down here? Okay. So, you guys see Jimmy go off here, and he's like... You know, he... You know, he's... he's, he's it's, it's dark enough... So that, you know, you're outside and it's dark, okay? So he's not within sight. You, Gretz can probably see him, right? Yeah. Because you have... Dark vision. Uh, dark vision. Anybody else have dark vision? Nope. Bah! No. No. Bah! Bah! Does. Okay, but your imp is with Irina yeah. inside. Yeah. Okay. He's spying on bah. the right too to make sure you don't do So down. as you're taking your shit, you can hear um, just off in the distance... Here we go. Awesome wolf owl. It's very quiet. It's a fucking Jimmy is, uh, Jimmy's gonna finish his business. Uh, he, he's going to. Any faster? Do you care? Does it bother you? Do you no, shit faster? Pretty close. Jimmy's not scared. Okay. He just so asserted dominance. On roll him. a twenty just for me, very quickly. So you, they're not, they're not being, they're not being quiet or secretive. Would you roll? Fifteen. So you can smell, in the breeze, you can start smelling like that sort of animal smell, that sort of dung and Jiminy's gonna dirt. Waddle, Jiminy's gonna waddle. It's a uh, smell you like. Jiminy's gonna so waddle on all fours to to, to grunts. Okay. My only other question is, did you do one or two? Both. You did both. Okay. And did you, did you clean yourself? No, of course not. He'll wipe his ass on the grass, I guess. Okay. So you're going to do it like the oh dogs God. do it? Yeah. Jimmy's okay. the official uh, Gratz is? Okay. So Jimmy, Gratz? Jimmy's gone from sheep to sheep herding dog. Gratz isn't eating the grass, but he has his face planted into the grass, pretending to eat it. Okay, so you're just kind of down here. So, Jimmy's wild out of the Gratz. blue, jumping <laughs> over the, the, the... I got him set up. How many times have you probably seen this coming into your... Into your view. I saw it, but I didn't want to say. Yeah, anything. I know. Everybody saw. It. <laughs> so they're they jump over the wall. There's a there should be. This is why I tried to teach these fucking sheep to jump over the fence. 
over on on this side of the fence one of the big ones that's sort of standing there and so four wolves are jumping over they jump over the fence as you're starting to cross this way they're going towards they the sheep are starting to run Can and they're trying to go towards one of the to sheep to see if they think Gretz or Jiminy Duh. looks like a delicious, delectable snack. Do I Duh. have like a delicious honey baked ham to them? Um, or do they see through? <laughs> Gretz is clutching the sword. So the they face. see right through. Okay. They, know neither, Fuck. they know neither one of you are sheep. We tried. Ridiculous. We did our best. You tried. Yeah, you tried. <laughs> they're going after the sheep, though. They don't. They don't really. They're not really even concerned about you. They're going after this one sheep. I'm kind of offended. Jimmy Carlisle, they started to run. Jimmy Carlisle's so, not going to let them go after that sheep. That's but you can is see. Is that law that they're going after? You can smell. You smell particularly that there's a large one on its feet. It's standing up and it has run into the clearing and it's 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 about ready to hop the fence. Okay, so I'm going to put it on the other side of the fence for you guys. All right. So you guys see Grutz laying down. Initiative? Oh yeah, it's true. We should roll it. There's no surprise here. I, I'm not going to worry about that. I got a five. You got a five? Yeah. You look like you... What the fuck was that? I got There's a 13. No Some of those walls are getting fucked right now. However, you still hear howling going on. Jimmy rolling. Those ones sound like they're dying. Yeah. <laughs> Jimmy rolled an 18. Jimmy's not scared. He's just a wolf. You rolled an 18? I rolled 13, 18. 19. 19. Jimmy. Holy shit, fucking don't, great. Don't downplay Jimmy's success tonight. 19. Who's who's next? I got a 5. Oh. Let's roll to 17. Uh, N got a 10. Okay, so Lazarus got a 13. Yep. Holy shit. And Gretz is last. I didn't really want to do it on initiative, but the werewolf has rolled a 20. Jimmy... 13th, uh, let's see, Lazarus is a 13th. So it is a werewolf. Ha! Ah. N is a 10. Of course. He confirmed it. Yeah, how many times have you done this? N rolled a 10? Yeah, and W got an 8. W got an 8? And Gretz is a 5. Gretz is a 5. A lowly 5. Yeah. Normally you're way up top. Yep. Okay. We're low tonight. Jimmy has to say bye. Okay. You're the leader of the sheep. So, um, boom. Okay, so this werewolf is going to jump the fence, and it's going to run straight over to Jimny. Oh, Jesus oh fuck! It wants it, it. It saw the sheep, 19. and then it saw a little fucking thing. Uh, well, <laughs> you took all your clothes yeah, Jimmy off. Took all his clothes you took all your clothes off. So that's okay. Yeah. It's probably right. a ten right now. It's. It's a plus 10 your plus your dex. Whatever your uh, dex bonus is. Let's say 10 plus my dex. So my dex bonus Well, your dex is going to be at least Is it a three? What's your dex? dex is, is plus, four? Five. plus so five. That's 15. So it's I have 15. He dex. still hits you. Of course he does. Jimmy's not as scared of him. He's just a werewolf. Yeah. He can't, he can't do anything to Jimmy. Yeah. He's okay. not going to hit him. Pull up my, is it going to be a bite? Again, I'm not even as scared of this. Should have him in here. Will Jiminy actually become the hairy gut that he was Jiminy, born to be? Jiminy is not afraid. That's a technical Jiminy, problem. Jiminy has a plan. I feel like it. I kind of us... picture Jiminy looking like a fat whitey from Eight Crazy Nights. Uh, he's fat not. A, he's not as hairy, but he's pretty. Oh close. yeah. Okay, that's a technical. Problem. I like that movie. I did too. Nah. It's disgusting, but I like it. Yeah, that sounds like more like a bird, doesn't it? Yes. Yeah, I was gonna say the, sure and, the, uh, the wolf sounds. Doing my best to do. Sure yeah, the, wolf yeah wolf I guess why. Oh, it's, uh, it's six at four yeah. hours. Four hours of we saving birds. We're only four minutes of wolves. I gotta turn the loop on. I don't know. We're funny. Wolf. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna wolf. We know that there's wolves. That's a lie. Yeah. That's a lie. Let's give me a headache. <laughs> There you go. Sorry. Because right. eventually those things go fucking berserk. They start going. Aah! Yeah, they do. They they want to wind it up a little. Yeah, bit. I don't okay. need that. Yeah. All right, Jimmy. Jimmy already knows exactly what is needed to be done. Play dead. Uh, no, I'm gonna throw my shit at it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my fucking god. Is that right? Yeah, might as well. 
If I'm going down, I'm going down humiliating his ass. <laughs> Sucks for him. I'm next. Okay. He gets two attacks. He's going to do one claw and one bite. Oh. <laughs> you have to get bite of that ass. The sound of sadness in your soul well, right there. I mean, someone had to do it. He's a wolf for the two. Somebody has to do it. I agree. Okay, so you take five points from the bite. No, five, six, seven. Excuse me. And his claw reaches out, sw takes a swing at you, and I'm just going to do seven for slashing damage. So fourteen total. Could have been worse. It's only about okay. half. Okay, now we go to Jimny. Jimny is going to scoop that <laughs> shit right off the ground and throw it right at this fucking thing. Just out of your ass? No, he or just he took just a shit. shit. Yeah, I know. Or you're going to take the shit that you had yeah. on the ground. Yeah, might okay. as well. Fuck this guy. You don't have any weapons? I don't have weapons. I, I'm naked. He, he, he went fully naked. He went out guy. there and yeah, we yes. he did that. Even I had my weapon still. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on. I'm going to say... Are you sure you would go out there knowing you're going to fight? Yes, he did it. I didn't know uh, we were fighting. Here's the thing. One, what? I expect my team to have my back, and nobody had my back ever. <laughs> what are you talking about? Gretz is fucking last. He's not going to be able to win. You would have gone out there without something. Two, I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll take my sickle. I'll, I'll yeah, that's fine. Sickle. Okay, come on. I mean, so you can still yeah. use the Do you want to use wanna a wanna bonus action to dip the sickle yeah. in your shit? You can do the shit. shit and then yeah. I, I'll let you do the bonus with the shit. Okay. So I, you I can attack the with the sickle. Okay. I'll attack him with the sickle, but I want to The problem is this shit. is a werewolf. So, you actually, I'm going to say your sickle's iron, so you're okay. You can I hurt can him with iron. Yeah, apparently I can attack twice now, someone told me. Yeah. Because yeah. you're level 5. Okay. Silver's effective so, iron is resistant, but it's uh, he, still damaged. He, you can hurt him with iron. Alright. So his, uh, let's see, his AC is 12. Not too bad. That's a 16. You gotta be, be a 12. The werewolves are just beefy. They have a lot of health. You hit once. You hit okay. once. I think okay. a sickle is a 1v8. It's these ones. So, up next is W. Hang on, I gotta roll. The W is yeah. the wolves. The W at 17 is wolves. Hang on, I gotta roll. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I rolled a 8. I gotta roll. Nobody, nobody wants to know how much I damaged him for. I want to know how I much. I do. I want to know. Two. <laughs> two. Oh, you hit him with two. Yeah. Yeah, and he threw a number two. So, so you hit him with the sickle for two points? Yes. Mm -hmm. How much does a side do? One d eight. One d eight. He rolled a one. Shit. Okay. All right. Yeah. And it's probably strength based, right? That's yeah, why. he has one to a strength. Yeah. You want to rape him. Yeah, you threw yeah, blue at him? Yeah. yeah. You're going to okay. want to rape him. So, Actually, roll. yeah, that's true. Okay. We should have him so, a here. You should roll to see what are you going to do with the poo? I'm just going to throw just, it down. Just throw it anywhere? Yeah, mostly his face. Well, I guess him Okay. Well, well, sure. Mostly his face, you know. And you want to try to hit his face. Yeah, right? sure. Get him in the yeah. eye. So, yeah. you're actually trying to do a uh, targeted throw. Yeah. Right? Yeah, I'm going to look at that. You want to roll I'm, I'm going to say you can use your dex. Yeah, you use right? your dex for a target. Oh, so yeah. you're probably going to hit him. So, But I'm going to say you have to roll like a 14. Okay. That's, that's I think a throw is athletics. 19. You're fine. You hit him. He rolled a 19. Okay. So, that, that hit for a 24. Yeah. Yeah. So that, that super hit. I'm not going to say that hurts him. No, it doesn't need I'll to. I'll say it kind of blinds him. It so can he'll blind be him. It can blind his senses. Uh, he feels it's shame. that bad a poo. Yeah, I agree. Jimmy Carlisle. Oh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm with that. It blinds us. I mean, at least a werewolf. He smells his shit. I think werewolves are more disgusting sentence. and tar-like. I got, you. I got it, you. This is this is not the kind of thing you would look. What Rufio did in there is nowhere near what you. this. The, Remember, what Jimmy Carlisle just Rufio's didn't guy. bother me like it bothered someone's yeah, shit. So, you know, but, someone's shit is always worth okay. at someone. So the the wolves that are circling. Um, they attack the, the sheep, this one sheep. No. They immediately hit it. No. And You're gonna uh, fuck that sheep up. Where are you, here? So the sheep is, is... What are you they doing, you paladin? I'm after... And they immediately I'm pull the it down. Okay? I'm at the so very bottom. So they have the sheep down. All right, so let's go to L, Lazarus, then N, and W. Okay, I'm gonna cast Elder Blast on one of the wolves. Just one of those wolves? Yeah. Or the Wait, werewolf? The werewolf. Okay. The wolf, so, the, uh, the sheep is down. That's is it dead or is yeah, it it's dead? dead. Uh, 13. 
Uh, Thirteen I hits. That's a hit, didn't I say? Yeah, that you said the AC is twelve. I think it was. His AC is. His AC is twelve. Twelve. Okay, so that's a two D ten plus seven damage. Wow. One. Don't two roll for you. Now he's got a face full of shit. A slight, a slight, a slight cut one. on his oh. finger. And he oh, he hit the, the fucking staff. Fifteen damage. Fifteen. There we go. Yeah, I have the staff. I have the D ten. Okay. Yeah. Um, next staff. up is W. And no, I'm sorry. Yeah, and then W. And then N Brett. is going to. Do, do, so do, 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 do. Yes, he's going to Hold bonus. On, let me see this. I'm go- now that we got this, let's see. How far he is. How far he is. So you're about 30 for 40 feet. Perfect. And N 35. And is, is going to go all the way up to that because he could go 45 feet to the werewolf. So you're going to dash up to him? No, or he, is that that's just, that's regular just regular run? speed. Okay. And then I'm going to. That's pretty good. Divine smite. I didn't smite. know you could go that fast, but that's yeah, the, the, the armor, right? No, it was the uh, the I stole one of his perks from the uh, bag of holding oh, tricks. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Um, I'm going to divine smite hit this fucking werewolf. Oh, he also got a movement speed one. I forgot. Uh, I got 16 and a 15. Could they both hit? Perfect. I oh, think this guy's gonna go down pretty quickly. Yeah, I so think that these divine guys whose wolves gonna... are still howling. Okay, so you notice they have the sheep down, but That's they're the howling. I can't re-roll two. And you can hear okay. off in the distance, Lazarus. 15, you can hear wolves 16, that are returning the house. Twenty. Twenty right. radiant damage. Twenty. Damn. Good job. <laughs> that's it, or is that both? That, that's it. Oh, okay. that's it. You know, you gotta reset it. Let me check. Just when they start quickly. crying and bitching, that's when you know. You no, it loops. Better. It's looping. Oh, okay. <laughs> You better hope it does, otherwise we're here getting birds. We're getting a werebird. Okay. It says only silvered. I know in some um, legends, silver. iron... Mine's detect- a magic source. Magic okay, source. Magic right. weapon should should All hold right. a... So, emergency. now we go to... Uh, uh W. W, I'm sorry. Uh, W do you need is to know going... distances, or... Yes, can I get the distance to the baby wolves? From him to the big okay. wolves. So to those wolves, it's 35 feet, and to the big wolf, it's also 40 feet. Perfect. W can reach those little wolves. I mean, he can. Cl- the closest ones are 35 feet, yeah, which means he can go the, 30 feet up. To and I'll be it. able to hit. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go up to them. I'm gonna bonus so you can action. Go, you can go 30 feet. Yeah. yeah. And then my okay, reach with good. my sword is 35. Is five feet. Yep. Um, I'm gonna bonus yep. action spirit shroud myself so I could deal an extra 1d8 radiant damage. Nice. And then I'm going to hit them with my weapon. Where's my d20? Okay. Twelve. Uh. Does a twelve hit? Yeah. Yes, I think oh, so. Perfect. I think I wolves probably have less AC wolves than are less. I don't. Hold on here. They might be more dexterous though. Well, they get the um, pack the benefit tactics? of the pack, yeah. It's awesome. Spirit Shroud's so cool. Actually, the wolf I see is 13. Hmm. I think a wolf hmm. might actually have more AC than a werewolf. That's depressing if that's the okay. case. It's just that they're more dexterous. I think you've attracted the little man with your wolves. You think so? I think he's uh, 13. Yeah. Oh, damn you know, it. one more. I you know. didn't hit. Okay. That ends my turn. Uh, so that was your movement. You need bonus? Uh, I already added the bonus. Okay. I didn't hit. Okay. Gratz is going to run to the little wolf to the left of... Of, uh... W? W, yeah. Here? Yeah. Now, just in case I kill him one hit, I'm going to make my first attack, so I can do two attacks, on the one in front of me. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. What I'm also going to... My spirit shroud, what it does... Is any creature of your choice that you could see that starts its turn within 10 feet of you has its speed reduced by 10 feet? Okay. So I'm going to do it to the uh, the clo- the wolf with the sheep. Right. So the one they in front just of killed it, so oh, nobody's okay. picked it up yet. I'll do it it's to just one of those. I don't want them to get the sheep. <laughs> okay. You're, so you're trying to prevent them from taking the carcass. Okay. I guess Grutz is going to rage as a bonus action when he's there, so he can get a plus two to his attack. And okay. then he's going to make a swing at the, wep- at the creature. I mean, I rolled the I rolled the net once, so I failed the first attack. Oh shit! Yeah, I'm gonna make my second swing. 
11 plus 22 to hit, so it hits. And so I deal 1d12. That's the wolf in the background. Playing with a squeaky toy. 18. 18 damage. Okay, so it's down. <laughs> Boom. Death. I believe it's this thing. Although I don't know that we can see it that well. So let me... Uh, She'll have in. so much food now. Let's zoom in a little better. Ah, he makes noises like that. Nobody touched him. I don't know. Okay. He has the toy. You have another hit? It's okay. You didn't do anything to him, so... No, no, know. no. I think it was the toy that made that noise. Oh, okay. Do you have a second hit? Right. Oh, no. I missed. I missed, missed the first, the first hit. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. I, okay, I have so such a high cluster. Werewolf. I fucked up the first Werewolf hit. takes a mighty swing at uh, uh, Jimny, and he... <laughs> what is your AC again? 15. 15. No, oh, 15. He 10. misses. You're no, it's 10, 10 plus 5. 5. Oh, 10 plus 5. 15. 15. All right, he misses you. So now it's Jimny. He should be terrified. I mean, he should have missed anyways. He's got poo in his Ooh, face. Oh, wait a minute. No, he misses. He's got he poo in two his attacks? face. He has two attacks. He does get Yeah, two but he has poo in his oh, face. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, okay. The other one, He's he also has uh, poo he in his a face. He's a bite and slash. He's at a disadvantage. He's so poo there's poo a 15 face. which would hit, but hold on. But he's poo in his face. Oh, 16. So he does hit. He, he hits you. So he hits you with his second attack. It could have been worse. Which uh, was, what did I say, seven? Uh, yeah, it was seven. Seven points of damage. So you're 20 right. minus 20. He's basically mm -hmm. not dead, but you know what? He's Jiminy Carlisle. Can you scoop out a second piece of shit? with the sickle that he was born with. Oh, wait, I was forget to do this. I'm going to cast Hunter's Mark on him. The other the other option mm -hmm. you have is to fucking book it. No, I mean, he takes Carlisle's a swing, but... Right. Okay, all right. Yeah, but I am casting Hunter's Mark on him, which will give me an extra... What do you have to do, guy? He just playing. makes noise. He's, yeah. And I get two attacks. So. He wants attention. Uh, one of those is a 20 and one of those is a 15. So they're both hits. Yes. Oh, you got okay. a nat 20. Yes. So. You double that yeah. one. So you'll double yeah, that. So double that one. So not that eight. one. No, no, no. It's no, an 8 God plus a It's one, an 8 so plus 8. Yeah. Okay. Is that, wait a minute. Hold on. On that one that's 9, does he get a plus to the hit? Uh, he gets a plus 1 to so 10 in total. So he got 10. 10 for the first okay. one. Okay. And then seven for the next one. So seventeen damage. No, oh, then you six. add your hunter's mark. Three. So twenty total. Look at that. For once, Jimmy Carlisle made job. somebody twenty cry. damage. It's pretty so good. you can see it's tottering. It's like it's in bad. That's right. Shape. Not only have I thrown my shit at you, I've made you totter. Okay. So as these wolves are here, <laughs> over the fence on this side, oh, jumps. Oh gonna, shit. I'm not gonna do all that. I just have them in case. A big white wolf. That's, that's the running. one we gotta kill. <laughs> and there's another one of these that jumps. Congrats, I leave those two. There's a bee killed. <laughs> and there's a couple more of these coming in. I'm not gonna use them all. But there is a white one, and you can see that it's significantly bigger. Hell yeah. Than and as you look at it coming, it looks really mean and nasty. Is it as, is it as nasty as Gregor was? It looks real nasty like that. Yeah. Okay. You can almost tell that it's almost like it's wounded, like its face yeah. has been wounded. That's right. Okay. The wolves themselves are going to... So this one's dead. And I marked it as dead, but I'm just going to get rid of it. Okay? So these wolves are now going to um, come up to N. They're a pack. They get advantage on attack. Yeah. Advantage on their attack, yeah. Um, that's a 16. Does and that has a, uh, 18. 18. And that's a, that's a 15. So they're all going to miss. Well, but not by much. Wow. Okay. So next up we have L. There's only one guy with an L. Okay. Then after that uh, is N and W. Where Can I see where the other werewolves are coming from? Yeah. They're coming in from the side away from you. Okay. Do you want me to measure it? I think you, we yeah. already measured you to the far end. Yeah, can you, you measure it. it? Yeah. Which do you want? The white one. The white one's 120 feet. This one's okay, it's just enough. Yeah, I think your range is 120. Yeah. Honestly, that's a it's smart thing way I didn't to play here. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. <laughs> How ironic. Okay, I'm gonna cast Eldritch Glass on the white one. And let's see. That's a 19. Hmm. Hmm. I gotta look that one up. It's a special one. It has special stats. Damn it. Do I want a battle of enmity? 
Oh yeah, I'm gonna do that. So I get advantage on all my attacks. What did you roll? A 19. Well, I think it's gonna hit. I need this and this. Damn. I don't know about that one, huh? Do you think that's the toy? No, I think I think, I, I think it's him, but I think it's his teeth. He thinks he's oh, it's his teeth. I think his teeth are gonna uh, come out soon. You hit him. You hit the white white one. Oh, okay. So you think they hurt him? I he's... think the teeth might be coming uh, out soon, or some of them might be falling out. Uh, four, I think he lost one. Fourteen plus uh, twenty-one damage. He's just rolling around into my feet. Twenty-one. Yeah. Okay. My All right, turn. So it's uh, in. I am going to bonus action use one of N's vows of enmity so he can get advantage on his attacks. Against the werewolf? Yeah. So, oh, wow, I rolled for action. Let's get ready. Fucking garbage. Yeah. I'm going to be running after the, uh, the white wolf. I only hit one of them and I got advantage on all his attacks. <laughs> God damn it. Really? Well, you know That's, what? You I'm don't gonna... usually roll like that. Who's around? Oh, I can't well, do it. Well, you've got, the, you've got the, the big guy, and you've got two of the others. I'm going to do it. I'm sorry. What? I'm sorry. Do I'm what? going to... Oh, no, I used my bonus action. Can you kill me? Well, I was going to activate my lightning sword, but I already used my bonus action. Oh. How? Huh? When did you use your bonus? For my vow of enmity. It's oh, a bonus okay. action spell. Six damage. A class okay. action. I missed all, only but all of my attacks except for one. That sucks. Which wolf are you attacking? The one the, you're the werewolf. With you, the werewolf itself, the big one. That no, yeah, the one, the, the one right next to her. And and yeah. it's attacking the werewolf in front of him. Yeah. So the one by him and Chimney. This one. <laughs> this one. I'm pointing. Hey. Which one? This one. Uh, this that one. one. That's the werewolf. Okay. So you 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 hit it with your sword. Yeah. And as you hit it and bury your sword into it, stab through it. It collapses. Oh, heck it's yeah. Down. Look at God, that, I got Jimmy. the last kill. Look at that. Jimmy <laughs> Carlisle did all the work and some fucker came and stole his kill. What a shame. Don't what you hate shame. it. Don't okay. you just hate it. So, what, a pathetic, it's w. what a pathetic character w you are. W is in. going to... He can swing at a wolf. Yeah, I know. This is awesome because I have my spirit shroud, but I'm also going to smite. I gotta go to W's abilities. W is going to thunderous. Smite this fucking wolf. Fuck it you up. know what? Should I? I'm just gonna do it. I don't care. I'm gonna fuck him up. Four, 14 plus 21. Does that hit? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, they're 13. Okay. As long as you don't roll your chair, you're fine. You can 12, kick him with your feet and stuff. 13. Oh, yeah, no, no, I've 16 had plenty of pets. damage. Okay. Below me. Uh, Six of that is lightning. Let me check. I think that's okay. And then seven of that's radiant. Yeah, there. That's okay. Okay. It takes every kind of damage. It doesn't care. Oh, sorry. So which one is it you hit? It goes down. Okay. Hell yeah. Is it this one? Yeah. You're like killing them all. Fucking him up. Okay. I'm saving that dead chief. How far is Grutz from the white wolf? He can make that distance. He's running over. So you gotta push. You're gonna push W. You're gonna go around. I'm gonna go around. I'm gonna jump over. I have 55 feet of movement. I think that's all we have to do. How do we get this to click like this, Michael? You, you can just assume the fuck. Takes five. Then I'll let 40, him go so through. 45. I'll yeah. let him go through me so it adds five to his run. If that's the case. Too. Yeah, in, in D and D, he can make way in the. Yeah, fight your still. allies can let you go through them. Oh, they yeah. can. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> enemies can block you, but allies can let you through. I think it's. A, I have fifty-five movement speed base. Yeah, without, I, I, that's all right. Uh, there's sheep running. in the way, but I won't. I won't worry about that. Okay. So this thing is worth it. Good. Boom. I'm gonna right fucking. There. I'm gonna fucking take two swings at it. Yeah. Don't miss. I get I get a plus fucking ten to hit. You missed the first one. The I did. Starting to scatter. Oh wait, I did not. You didn't even roll d twenty. I didn't even roll d twenty. What did you roll? Eight. D twelve. I'll take those. 
Yeah, you're fine. I can hit with that. That'd be okay with me. Got a nat one and one, so it absolutely misses. The other one's a 27 to hit, so that should hit. What the fuck is me? A nat one? Yeah. So I miss. Ooh, yeah, that's... yeah, but you might lose your sword. Yeah. yeah I guess. I have one of your swords fly out of your I only have one sword. Oh, fuck. I have a great sword. Uh, I'm no longer dual wielding. You can make him re-roll the one he hit with. That would... No, I'm not going to do that. I'll let him I'll let him mm -hmm. hit. Um... Or making like I'll tell you what. Let's okay. Why don't roll you a, roll a six-sided die? If you roll low, you fall down. Okay. If you roll high, you your sword you lose your sword. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use one of my ten free rerolls. Reroll the one. Okay. I forgot I had that. I was just gonna ask if you also have an inspiration or something. I, I have no I have no idea if I have inspiration, he does. but I know I do. Okay. I, I know can reroll. Ten times, and I rolled like five or six times yeah. already. How many times have you done it already? Six you're times. You're keeping account. Six or? times. So this is the seventh. Okay. So does a thirteen hit him? No. So the Why twenty-seven wolf? hit. No. So I roll for damage. Sixteen. But at least you don't have the 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 problem. Yeah. Sixteen. Yep. And it's hmm. from a magical sword. Sixteen, you said. Yep. Okay, because Lazarus hit it too. Okay. Ha, You're done. I hit more than you. <laughs> I missed okay. one fucking hit. <laughs> Let me do this. Okay. Um, so. What do you know? And then I, roll, I rolled a 9 out of 7. So this is the other werewolf. It's okay, I'm rolling poorly too. Yeah, really bad. Okay, so this, the white one is called <coughs> White Claw. So WC oh, shit. Water Closet. Oh shit, it must like alcohol. And then yeah, the no. werewolf that's come in to play here is the seven. So we're going to go back up top. The werewolf is dead. Heck yeah. So let's go to Jimny. What's Jimny going to do? Jimny These two have jumped in, going to... You naked, you got a sickle. Yeah, Jiminy's gonna. Uh, really? Need to get you like a scimitar. We need to get him like a scimitar or a rapier. Yeah, yeah, or a short sword. Something with finesse. Uh, I think short swords are finesse. He'll be able to attack a lot easier with those. Jimmy Kyle is. Well, Austin boosts his damage as well. Yeah. Yeah. Where are you at in terms of your. I'm right where N is. Well, I know yeah, yeah, short swords aren't finesse. Want to accomplish? Uh, you, there's a little uh, wolf. I mean, I, I killed a wolf all by myself. It's a martial weapon. Which one? Okay. The werewolf. I killed the werewolf. No. This guy came you in and swooped it with in. Two. As it was they falling did down. The two. Look. Lazarus. Yeah, and then I hit it with like a 20. You know? You but, did hit it with but something. this guy comes in. You did hit it. That's as true. It was, as it was teetering and tottering. I hit it too. Bleeding. You hit it with a 20. Bleeding and covered in shit. And, I hit it with a 20 and a 6. Right, 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 right. You did put it at a disadvantage. I just gotta say. So what do you want to do? You know, she, she, her character comes in, so and what do you as want it's to do? already falling, she stabs it real quick to make it look like she killed the werewolf. Now. And you recognize that, because that's what you do all the time. Jimmy Carlisle has never done what such a cheap, in his what life. What a cheap hit. Jimmy Carlisle can move his hunter's mark onto one of those wolves and attack that one. Okay, which then one? Then, uh, Top or bottom? Which one's more dead? None. Neither, Neither of those have been hit. Okay, uh, I'm going to do the one next to end. The one next to end? Yeah. Okay. One ear on. He's and fresh. That fucker twice. He's fresh. Okay. What if I speak to animals with them? Teach them to to to. Well, you could, you could talk. Go to, against their way. You could probably talk common hey to the guys, animals. Hey Yeah. Don't hey, hurt us. Hey, hang on. Yeah, you look at them. You say, Hey, hey look, guys. Look, that that big white one. Should, that's not a real wolf. Oh, all you have is a baker. It's a sheep. It's a guy. Are you trying to start a? Uh, I'm just trying. I'm just saying. Revolution in the wolf. Uh, maybe but, not right revolution. now. It's not working. I guarantee uh, you they can jump. That's a nineteen. Yeah. They're even better than the sheep. They can fucking jump. What is their AC or whatever? Your AC is a 13. Oh, okay. You're good. That one definitely doesn't hit, but this one does. Um, I gotta stop rolling poorly. And you had your 1d6. 5, 6. Uh, 12. 12? Yeah. Oh, well, it's dead. Yes. You see, that's how you kill a wolf. Which one did you hit? That one. one. right next to him. Okay, next up we have the wolves. So, this oh, wolf dad. is going to bolt 
That's right. The, take the, grab the carcass no. and run. No. How fast can so, I run with a big sheep only? Uh, fast enough. Does Zen get an yeah. opportunity yes, attack? Yes, you get an opportunity. Oh, did Jimmy? No. Get you're not clear. Yeah, it's mm. in the way. Yeah, you took my dice. This is Zen's dice. Look, get that out of here. I don't use those. Well, I rolled and I got a, a miss. Okay. Damn. This is why you should trust Jimmy to kill wolves. I mean, he's already killed a werewolf and a wolf. I'm just saying. So it's going to grab the, 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 the carcass by it with its mouth and it's it's running. So I'm Does just gonna W it, get I'm an just, opportunity? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'll let W have an opportunity. Because I'm a nice guy. Yes, 20. Not a nat 20, but a dirty 20. Okay. Nice. Dirty 20. Might as well have been a 19. Well, 16. That's, that's true. You, 16? Yeah. Holy shit. It is dead. Nice. Bingo. Fucked it up. It's because I have my spirit shroud on. Jimmy's going to tug it and... Lazarus. Okay. I need help. <laughs> I need help. I I'm dying. Going Jimmy to die. How much health do you have? Uh, four. All right. No, I have eight left. Eight. Okay. I am going to cast spike growth in <laughs> between. So you might want to open up the circle. Like mapping. Open up the circle tool. It should be. I uh, go go to the left, uh, below the like person or like icon. It's the the, the right ruler. Icon. That that's like the ruler. Okay, now drag that until it hits like twenty feet. Oh dear God! All right, once you get to twenty feet, you're gonna yep. kill the sheep. No, no, no! Move the move the circle. Yeah, I, I was gonna say, where do you want it? You should be able to draw it out and then just move it. How do I name. delete it and start again? I delete. The delete key, I think. Okay. Where do you want it at? I want it so it doesn't hit the sheep, but it only hits the the two werewolves and the two wolves. Oh. So just stretch it out first and you should be able to drag it, I think. Oh, no, that can work. That'll work. It'll hit gruts, but that's You're okay. Gonna hit gruts. That's I fine. I can move it a little bit to the right. No, that's fine. You can, keep, you can keep it. That's fine. Uh, I'm not sure. Well, uh, Try clicking on it and dragging. This? It's got to go 20 feet though, right? Yeah. But I can play around. Uh, try clicking on the middle of it and seeing if you can move it. Or No. Does that just delete it? Yeah, I deleted it. All right, something like that. Okay. <laughs> it, how far a range do you have? Uh, 150 feet. Oh, okay, yeah, that'll make That's it. That's even farther than your Eldritch Blast. <clears throat> So basically, whenever a creature moves within or out of it, they take 2d4 piercing damage for every 5 feet they move. Oh, I would have been fine, though, if you kept it over me. Mm -hmm. I would just Oh, you might have killed all the sheep, though. Yeah. <laughs> they would have been running, taking fucking 2d4 um, damage. I think that, unless you have a bonus action, that That, should that be is it, right? his action. Yeah, that, that, that's my action, so that would be the end of my turn. End. Where's that at? He's way over here. And's gonna heal Jiminy for 21 HP. Thank God. Way on here. Jiminy Carlisle is like a new man. Okay, so. That's a white claw. This W is going to move up like. Er, well, hold on. Let's go this way. It's gonna move up like this. Okay, so he's gonna take 2d4 piercing damage. It's 4. Seven damage. Okay. And then it's going to continue and it's going to run. Does Gretz have an opportunity to Yes, he I does. do. Uh, does a 14 hit? No, it does not. I'm on low. So it's, you're just off. So it's going to bolt. And as it bolts, um... Let's try to make it at least worthwhile because you guys wiped them out so fast and so hard that my, my, my dice is screwing me so, so it's going to but you can hear it uh, you can sort of hear it in a raspy voice foul creatures you hear it speak okay you hear it talk. Foul creatures. Take my dinner. This one is going to... is not up yet. I'm sorry. It's The next one is W. Let me see what I can do. Uh, 
So as you look at it, Gratz, as you, you see it taking, you got close enough, it looks like it has had a claw mark go through its nose. Part of its nose is gone. Yep. Its fur is white. It is considerably larger than even the regular werewolves. Yeah. It's like it's like a, um, like an a, alpha. The, yeah, it, it obviously it's like another foot taller or yeah. so. Uh, very, very muscular, beefy and such. But um, not as stocky as you would think, so it's a little more like... Nimbler? Lithe, yeah. yeah. And you also noticed uh, boobs. Holy shit! I'm going to... Okay. It's a girl wolf. I'm going to try to chaos the, bolt, the, the white claw. Wolf. Okay. You need a distance, or...? Uh, I go. I can go 120 feet. Oh, you've got it. Okay. And I rolled a 19. That's a hit. Okay. I did 12 uh, lightning damage. Okay. So the shock comes out of your hand, and you see it strike her, and it kind of. She kind of jolts a little bit, and you can see some blood sort of come out of her. She's looking pretty rough, but she continues to run. She's she's getting away. All right, this one is also going to move out of this zone. It's just right, running two D four. Six. Okay. Uh, and it will continue running straight. Got some sheep in its way. So it if go. it's dashing, it could probably double its speed. Um, should I just go after the white wolf since it's not quite gone? Yeah, that's what it's going to do. It's just trying to take off because its boss took off too. So it can go. It can. They can go forty feet. So they could probably so go it went eighty. Five, so this is. So yeah, it's going to. It's going to start. Yeah, it's going to bolt to the. Yeah. Um, I need to move this out. And it's going to jump the fence 40, 100, and mm -hmm. uh, it's basically going to wait. So if it goes 45, 40 feet, let me check what, let me check what. So if its speed is 40 and it's trying to disengage I think its feet, speed dash, is 40. That means it could go 80 feet. Yeah. And it already moved 5, so it could go 75. The White Claw one could probably actually be farther than that. If it was trying to run. <sighs> yeah, I should have moved her off. Yeah. Enough. Yeah. Yeah, it's 40 feet. That's what I thought. So, 75 feet. It's going to take it basically to here. So, I will move it, which... Damn it. To there, boom. So, puts it right near Mr. L. This one's gone. Yeah, gone. that one's probably gone. Okay. Grutz. Yes. Uh, can I see what I can? What's nearby me? Um, two wolves. There's two wolves. I'm gonna run into them. Okay. Yep. I'm, I'm gonna take the damage for two d four. So you're gonna go here? Yep. Yes. Right. right. Is it when I enter or when I yep, leave? Yeah, when you enter it or. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna take the TD4. It's not that eight. Big a deal. So it's half to four. Okay. You rolled the fucking max. Yeah, yeah. I did roll the max. I, got, I took four damage, and I'm gonna take my first attack on the wolf in front of me. Oh uh, no, not this dice. That dice <laughs> gave me ones the whole fucking time. I know. <laughs> One. Yeah. Twenty-nine to hit. So let's see the damage. One, 13. Dead. And then I'll make a swing at the second one. Uh, that's a 14 to hit. That's a hit. And I dealt 6 plus 18 damage. Yeah, it's dead. Okay. Okay. We're feasting tonight, so, boys. So those guys are gone. Jiminy, is there anything you want to do? Jiminy wants to spit on N. No. Ooh. Yeah, I just healed you, so if you spat on me, I'd be pissed. Where, where are the wolves? They're, They're all gone. dead. Oh. They're basically, everything's <laughs> dead. dead. 
There's a line oh, of fire. Fire. Away. You can spit on one that's Except right by you. Except for the werewolf that's running by. Jiminy's gonna... He's gonna start stabbing one of the dead ones. Sure. <laughs> After all, I mean, <laughs> nothing like making sure... Jiminy's gonna, gonna go Jiminy's gonna go to the werewolf that's dead. Yeah. He's gonna start beating the shit out of that so it looks like he did more damage to it. Sure. He's a clearly hit from a sickle, obviously. Lazarus. Okay, I'm gonna cast Elder Class at the one running mm -hmm. towards the mill. That's a 7 plus 7, 14? 14? That's a hit. Okay. Let's see. 6, 9, 16 damage. Okay. So your blast goes out and hits. That's the first time it's been hit. I, uh, I also took six damage from running out of the thorns. Oh, six. That's right. That's uh, there. I see. I don't six. think it's. I don't think that much damage is going to kill. Where we're I don't think it. And then I am going to use the repelling blast to push it back ten feet. Okay. Can you? Is that a bonus? It, it's something that I can add on to my elder class. It's it's like a feature that uh, warlock. Warlock has. Okay. But is it a bonus action? That's no, it's not. Sense. Whenever it's an attack is made, you get to choose. Yeah, yeah, it's just like a passive trait you can add to it. So every time you hit, you don't necessarily say you're doing that. Uh, it's usually something you can choose. You can choose to do. It's like yeah. a pack bonus. Okay. So it's not like a force thing. It's a choose thing. It's like one of my things is agonizing blast, and it's what lets me add my charisma modifier to the damage of my elder class. And and then W. Um. N is going to start taking the heads off of the wolves. Oh, you're copied with Grace's going to do as well. Um, w is going to heal Grace. I only took four damage. I'll just healing word you. Okay. For two plus four. He's thirty-five six. feet away. Just I'm so full you. health. A healing word is like a is. You don't have to touch. No, healing word is spoken. It's like it's like hearing it heals you. Okay. Yeah, it's sixty feet. <laughs> Yeah, that wolf is going to run like 80 feet. Run? Yeah, no, it can only go... Uh, it could go 80 uh, if it's running. If it's 40 range, 40. it can double. It's 30. If it so can, it's, oh, it's so it's 40, 60. I'm sorry. So it can go 80. So it's yeah. going to go into this sort of uh, crop of And if Michael can't trap. see, he can't hit yeah. it. But uh, knowing Lazarus, he's, he's going to want to... Uh, yeah, I'm going to try to take one more... He, he'll it. just want to... Snap out uh, of it. God damn it. He's killing this poor defenseless sheep. Deserves okay. what it's getting. While I'm at this too, I'm, just, I'm gonna break concentration on the spike growth. Thank god. I was gonna walk out triumphantly and take more damage. Because that's what reaction does, so it doesn't take an action to do. So let's just. Well, check. it's a concentration, so yeah, it doesn't yeah. take an action to it break concentration. You're 90 feet away. But okay. can he see it in the crops? Yeah, that's the question. I have like a bird's eye view, right? I guess it depends on what type of crop uh, it is. Yeah, corn stalks goes real, real high. You'd have to go to the ruler mode, uh, the second mode. There we go. And you hover over the little oh, the center and hit delete. And then you can delete it. Do do. The distance calculator thing's pretty useful. Yeah, it is. It is. Um. This is just something they put in here. Look at that, like, it looks like it's supposed to be corn. So it's going to be very well hidden. That's what I'm going to guess. Corn's okay. very high. It's high if it's yes. higher than it. Well, you know what? Yeah. You can put a scarecrow out for anything. Yeah, I guess That's to true. prevent the crows from eating. I'll just let you hit it. Okay. I mean, you're not going to kill it, just so you know. But yeah, it might make just you one more good. stab. Just yeah. makes you feel good. Okay, that's a 19. Too bad it's, it's not a crit. Oh. Two. The little guy fell asleep. Not, not good. Nine, so that's 11, 18. Okay. I'm just going to check. Or I have 16. Oh, wait, 2 plus 9, yeah, yeah it's 18. Okay. 2 it's plus 9 going. is 11. Yeah, but plus 7 damage. Oh, okay. I'm excited right. to drink the moonshine. So, um, let's just, um, we're a little late. We got a little late started. So, how do you want to wrap this up? Obviously, you've got a bunch of. I'm going to cut the heads off. Put them all on stakes. Okay. That's what I'm doing so too. The first thing I heads. need to do is Jimmy Carlisle turn those guys off because the they're not making any. Jimmy Carlisle was. I'm gonna do my to idea. You get them to know that this is your territory by putting you pretty up much their wiped dead. them out. Okay, which I I planned. I figured. And now and we need Gretz's pee yeah. everywhere. Gretz is gonna start pissing. Okay. Jimmy already shat. 
Technically. He's going to okay. pull out his fucking pants and he's going to fuck. Okay. He's going to walk as he piss around the pen. <laughs> okay, that sounds good. That makes you feel we good. We should put a sign that says Danger Bears. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. All right. So, um, so everybody's... Uh, so, Lazarus, you can come down. So, Ovidia comes out and she's... You know she's she's watching it through the Lord's word. Watching, yeah, and I, 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 Irina comes out, and Irina's sort of swaggering. She, she's you can hear her sort of telling Ovidia. She's like, "See, I told you to be able to get rid of them, no problems." That's right. So Ovidia says, she does say um, to you all very quickly. She says, uh, "What was that big one? We saw it from inside the big one. Oh, was the white one. The fucked up one. The fucked up face. That's a female. Is a fucked up face? Wait, yeah. Was it blind? No. Why are you asking that? Huh? I don't know. Oh, okay. Gretz, 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 didn't, didn't. Gretz didn't stare at the eyes. That fucking big breast as a female. Yeah, you could tell. It was I had a fucked up face. Yeah. So you don't know anything about Maybe it. it's the yeah. alpha. It's probably alpha. Can female be alpha? If they're big enough. Irina says female can be alpha. Sure. Well, in, in Wolf World, all that matters is strength. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Yeah. So Ovidia says she sees you pissing all over, and she says, uh, "Thank you." Yeah, I'm sure that'll keep them away for a yeah. long time. Yeah, it'll, it'll fucking remember me. I yeah, fucked that yeah, bitch absolutely. up. Absolutely. She says the heads are kind of gruesome, but uh, she says uh, they'll get better as time eats at them. Do you want the the meat? I, I yes. I don't I don't care for wolf meat myself. Yeah. But if you want to butcher them, you can butcher them. She says yes. werewolf meat is not so. Good, you you ate it, but it's up to you if you want. Well, to okay, eat. some so in some people in some people's country, that's all you gotta eat. Okay, it's either so, that or other people. So l- let's just say that you uh, are gonna, sl- you know, like whack it up. You guys are not professionals at it stuff. I would skin. like to try to yeah skin them so I can make fur coats for at, people to wear for Grotz, the cold weather. Okay, it's lived in a land of harsh environment where all he really had to eat was wool. Do I have experience in butchering them? Yes, you do, of course. Yeah. Yes, of course. Sure. So, oh, is that a so you had or? about, uh, I want to say about six to eight wolves there between. The I'm wolves going and the to werewolf. use the werewolf, the big, the big werewolf. You got one werewolf. I'm yeah. going to give that pelts to Gretz to, have yes. to keep him warm. And W yes. knows so you how to sew. So you just have the pelt, right? <laughs> I mean, you got the pelt itself, and it's it still needs to be tanned. <laughs> So it still needs to be cured and tanned and stuff like that. I mean, if you give it to him, it's it's kind of nasty. I'll prestigitation it. Like it, but bloody. I'll prestigitation it. You can do that, but it's functionally doesn't fix it. It's not going to work until someone actually does the work. Yeah, so you're going to probably want to do something more with it or trade or whatever and stuff. But you know, um, uh, Ovidia says you can take these materials to Kresk. I'm sure they will. They will buy these things from you. They'll trade with you. They can always use furs, right? Okay. And she says, if you don't have furs, you're going to need furs yeah. in Kresk. She can't tell. Well, from Grotz used to have... You guys don't have anything. Do Grotz you? used to have furs. You used to have furs. But then I got uh, a nice w rich people out there. has a robe that he got from the wizard tower. Yeah. I'm not sure. You're basically naked. You've got a robe on. Yeah, but Grotz has been Jimmy's naked in the cold nothing. for so long already. You guys have just got the clothes that you got from the, the tailor in Velaki. Yeah, I have a robe from the tower. It's okay. Grutz used to cold. Robes are, lived robes his whole are life not, in snow. They're not going to keep, not gonna keep you warm. Grutz lived snow. his whole life in the snow. You're tough. Yeah, but you had there. You had you had fur. Ba- a bear barbarian has warmth. So, so video brings you back in the house, and she says, "For, for my hair is like fur." Thank you for what you did. You you can take the materials, and she's going to hand you a uh, a glass jar, and she says, "I've kept this." Special from my mother. Um, it was a it was a gift from her to me, but I give it to you. And she says this is a restorative ointment. So if you use this, it will help you to heal, and it will cure poisons or 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 uh, um, diseases. Oh shit! So it's a restorative ointment. Um, the jar is about three inches in diameter. Like and thirty occurs. It's got. It's like somebody roll a one d four for me. I, I don't will. care which one of you does it. I got it too. So it has three doses of this thick mixture. It smells sort of like aloe. So it cures poison and diseases. Yeah, one dose. Okay, so you, when you when you apply it, you can swallow it or you can apply it to the skin. You'll regain two d eight plus two hit points. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's a possible 
you know, 18 points. Yeah. Is that yeah. kind of, wait, it, are we so far in the rules we get the maximum? I, I think since that's, not with this. Okay. This that's a, a salve, it's not a potion. Yeah, it's a potion. It's not a potion. That's like, it's like a rubbing component more than a potion is. It's like a if paste. you want to try to sell it, um, it's worth about 400 gold pieces. I don't think we need to. No, I, honestly, I think it's best use is just to cure disease and poison. Mm -hmm. Okay. So then she's going to say to you, um, anytime you come this way, she is more than happy for you to stay. Awesome. Thank you for your help. Hopefully this um, clears up the wolf problem for a little bit. She's going to... Pardon? I said, I'm going to say hopefully this helps clear it up for a little bit at least. She's Yeah, she's <laughs> she's like confident that this is going to help her to get her flock back. Mm -hmm. um, now that she also knows that the flock has some feelings for her, emotion, thanks to Jiminy's sort of interrogation, right. she's going sure. to try to take better care of them. They think, right? they they think use she's them less that. for meat and more they for... They think she's a hottie. That's right. Right. So yeah. she's going to, so in, in the house that she gives you this ointment, she's going to pull out a couple of like dream catchers and things, and she's hanging them back up, and she says, before you came in, I put, put these away because there are those that don't understand us. That might. But she says, I, I am, my background is uh, a druid. Oh. So that is why I do not know anything about the Vistani. Yeah, yeah. In fact, I find the Vistani to be somewhat vile. Yeah. Yeah. She says to you, um, if you need any information about druids, I'm willing to give you information. Do you have a dream catcher I can have? I've had a lot of weird nightmares. She's going to take here. one and she's going to give it to take the map and she's going to circle where the windmill is and she's going to say, this, <laughs> Oh, I fucking knew it. Oh, God. She says, This is one of. <laughs> he broke power. it! No, I didn't. Did you break it? No, I didn't. So, well, not him, our last wizard broke no, it. No, I didn't break it even back then. We destroyed it. Yeah, we did. We broke it. We I broke did, Yeah, I we did. did. We, okay, I we did. What did you do? We she broke the you pillar broke. One of the rocks. One of the rocks broke. How? Uh, our shot, previous wizard shot magic at it. He shot magic at it. I'm going to replay that. She's no, I know exactly what happened. Don't you shit on that. So you can tell she's. I hope you don't, Michael. I I know exactly what happened. So she's very play. upset. You I'm can tell she's very upset, play. and she says, "He's you dead." Have, you have you have helped me, yet you have hurt my. He's people. dead. You have very much hurt. He my he people. did it without I'm, us, I'm and he's dead. Check this next he did it though. He's dead. Your association with him. You need to understand that the, this land is I, very precious and very very. Um, uh, uh, hmm. it's, it's very uh, um, um, fragile, so you need to respect those oh, things, I respect especially nature. that you don't understand. I respect nature. So she asks you, what what happened to it? Uh, oh, there, there are a bunch was, of hags doing ritual well, sacrifices on it. Yeah, there was hags it. killing kids on it, and there was a lot of little bones on them. So we thought that's where they were sacrificing. Yeah, they were them. sacrificing them on it. So she, um, so you can tell she's like sort of sitting there, and she's not. She's so we really, thought if we destroyed really it, it pissed. would prevent them from doing the sacrifices. Yeah. Are are they? We killed them. Well, well they're not they dead. Away. Dead. They they're away. not dead. Dead. They're, it's hard to kill a hag. They're night hags. Why did you have to desecrate the shrine? Well, they desecrated. We thought it was their. It. Yes, they are desecrating it. Yes, stone. definitely. What? We thought that by destroying it, it would prevent them from doing the sacrifices. Mm, they were convenient so, so with the dark so power yeah. on it. She said, "Okay, I understand your. You don't have the knowledge or understanding. That is a that is a very powerful um, spot. Maybe there that's why the fish killed the wizard. There's another. You, I'll, if you if you are going to go to those areas, she's not going to draw any more on the map for you. Okay. <laughs> she says, if you find any more, you can come and ask me, but do not destroy anything. Okay. No, I am going to look her and I say, I think I know a way to help." everyone out but it involves the four fey shrines but you're already fucking it might be it might i didn't do it no, so don't you dare bring that up no, so what do you know about the shrines it is. i think they could be they could be used my theory is is they could be used to get maybe ravenloft out of uh barovia out of ravenloft potentially or at least get people out of ravenloft she says um it's like a teleportation. Yeah. She says, um, 
the magic is not that type. It's it. They cannot themselves be used as portals, but they have a huge power over these lands. These portal, these 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 um, these runes are are part of the land. They have been here forever, and so I'm sure. Although you did damage to it, I'm sure that the power that is there is still there. Oh, the table is not dis destroyed. Just one of the little pillars. But I have to, hit. you know, I have to show respect to my, and you must show respect mm -hmm. to our, our people and our past as well. And you, you must make amends for, for that. Well, he, the one who did it died. But you're still part of it, and I would look to you, as you have done and helped me, I would look for you to do more help to my oh, people. Oh, yeah, of course we're going to help people. Okay. Because we're heroes. Sure, I want, like I that. wish to believe the good that you have. So my guidance to you is that they are not portals, but their strength is over the, of the lands. They are part of the land, and that strength has been stolen. It is no longer residing with my my peoples. It is lost. Because the devil's one. Because of the devil. Did we do he... not know where the power is gone. Okay. So maybe by do you know, it won't be Do you know words. of our, our background? No. Grush she doesn't says, read. There is a there are several there are only a couple of sources that you can go to to get more depth of this information. She says one of them is a desk elf. He is as old as the land. Mm -hmm. I know he has a lot of information. His name is Casimir. Oh, he is near Valaki. We talked with him, I think. Mm -hmm. You talked to him? Yeah. Well, he will not freely share this information. But tell him you met me and that if you he's may... If still alive, he's in Valaki. Casimir is... is He'll is, survive. Is a, is a survivor, yeah. Wait, is she going to point out the other locations? No. No. Can I try to persuade her? Show me, show me good faith, and come back. Okay. And I will, I will, I will. Uh, is gonna yeah, you couldn't keep your fucking mouth shut. <laughs> We're the group of loose lips, okay? <laughs> you guys complain that N W or loose lips. Grunts is just as bad. Well, I'm gonna double check the footage. No, I'm we telling you, that's what happened. I know what fucking happened. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna we could double, do that. I'm gonna double we could do that. She's I'm going to tell a, you. I'm and play it next week. The reason I yeah, live by myself is I have a curse. What's your curse? What's your curse? It's nothing you can help me with. Oh, but, come on, we're all a little cursed. But perhaps you can help my people. So she says, the beasts that you, you, you dealt with, she said, I, I have... I have a curse of that as well. Oh, you're a werewolf. No, not quite. Were bear? No. Were owl? No. Were raven? I'm um. Uh, I'm cursed as a jackal were. Oh, I've seen. Wait, she so says Strahd has work? cursed me. Huh? Why didn't silver work on you? Uh, because uh, I don't know. <laughs> I wish I could throw a curveball at you, <laughs> but I didn't think of that ahead of time. So. Um, I'll have to come up with something. Dude, I could have. We could have potentially a kill there. Right she there. basically, yeah. You don't. You don't want to. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's okay. I didn't think far enough ahead. So it's you're, okay. You're more clever than me. Sorry. Just because you're aware of Chagrin doesn't so mean you're says, not beautiful. She uh, says, "Strahd cursed me because uh, we have revolted against him. My people have revolted against him. Mm. And if you are against him, then I believe you will help my people. Oh yeah. So All that's right. why I think you can come back and I can talk to you more." She says, but I'm unable to control this change. So during the week of a full moon and at night, I, I have to lock myself in the windmill. So don't come here when I, that happens to me. Do not okay. come on a full moon. She says, otherwise I will help you and do everything that I can for you. She says, uh, the druids are emboldened and we are revolting. We want to revolt against Strahd. But uh, we're seeking leadership. She says, do you know where, where my people are? The south you of know? Kresk, right? Yes. In the hills. Yeah. We're going to go there at some point. Is there a tree there? A yes. big tree? Yes. We have something that we're searching for to help us yeah. with Strahd. 
that's do under all. the tree. Do all. Do, do well, all. Weather. How do you know about this? We were told we were our friends. Madam Ezra. Madam Eva. Madam Eva. Eva. Gra Gra Sounds Vistani. Yes. She's there also against Straw. This group specifically, and they gave us quests to help find us. Most of Vistani are not against Thrad. Yeah, but Madam Eva is different. This apparently will give us the. Uh, well, I think I think Madam Eva uh, wants to. This will help us find a help sword. Him quotation mark by. She gave you this information. Him. Yes. You think, and she gave this to you to help you against him. Yes. Yeah, because mm. practically he's cursed just as much as the, as the land curse. He is cursed, uh, but I believe he has cursed this land. Yeah. And all the people who are in it, and you as well. Tactically, if he, that was your master, the right thing to do would be to end him. I will do everything I can to help you. You are not the first that have come into these lands, but you are the first to have helped me. But we will be the last. <laughs> you will be the last? Because we are going to succeed. All right. She says, I, I, you can spend the night. Take, take what you can. I've given you all that I can. And as you pass by, if you come back this way to Yesler Hill, let me know how okay. things have gone for you. Okay? Okay. Okay, and with that, we'll end it for tonight. A little long, but uh, uh, you accomplished what you needed to accomplish for the most part. I'm sorry about the coin. I didn't think about that. Okay. See, there's so much to this. There's so many, there's so many ways I can yeah. get tripped up. I just thought it would have been and funny if we did it. And I, did something dumb because well, here's the deal, too. Yeah, see, that would have been bad. Yeah. And it's actually, I, I gave you, you, as my tendency is with you guys, I don't know, you know, like, it says I don't, I don't have to give you that information, but I always give you everything, right? Because why hold stuff, you know, that's... So it's like you know this. I, this I, might be something you can use in the game. I am and planning me too. on finding that part where we do stuff to the shrine to figure out what exactly we did to it. Well, that was good. Good game. So we skip next week, right? And then we we're have a we have a break next week, and then oh, in two weeks. We have a two week break. Okay. We have That's okay. This brought us back, sort of. You yeah. were able to accomplish it something. Us something. Yeah. Nice yeah. Gives us time to think. So what this also does is it gives me time. Yeah, it gives me time to maybe fix this, and also maybe it lets. So this was kind of a good character and good lesson because not everybody you run into is bad, mm -hmm. and they can have problems and still be good. Yeah. So, Sometimes but people you've learned minutes. more again, right? Yeah. You're gonna things are gonna start rolling well, for that's you. Cool now when we go back, we can ask her about the, 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 the tree, because she said it says it's an individual okay. quest. So I have 